Hello there you guys, welcome back. Hope everyone's having a fantastic Saturday thus far. I missed you guys yesterday. It was really weird. Around two o'clock we were like wandering around the fair and I was just like, I should be streaming right now. <laughs> but welcome back, welcome back you guys. Uh, no cam today, no cam. I am not in the mood. Um, however, I am very much in the mood to stream with you guys and just hang out. I always miss you guys. Pepper, thank you so very much for the biddies. You're about to see it pop up on stream, hopefully. There it is. Awesome. Thank you, Pepper. <laughs> yeah, it's weird when I don't stream because I do stream every day at a set time. It, the days that I don't are just weird and I don't know what to do with my time. Um, that being said, Mike and I did have a lot of fun yesterday and I can tell you guys all about it in a little bit. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to scroll up in chat, try and say hello to everyone. So, Jacob, Lindenbox, Stretch Cherry, Ark, Saucy Simmer, Zach, uh, who else have we got in here? Gamer Pie, welcome back, you guys. You guys have been here with me for a little while. Um, Lizzie, hello, hello. Who else have we got in here? Do, 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 do. Sorry, just trying to get through all these names at the beginning. Perfect Luster, hello, welcome back. Um, Random and Pepper, of course. You guys are more than welcome. Uh, do, 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 do. Names, 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 names. There's so many names. <laughs> Natalie, hello, CGW. Welcome back. Fire, please. Oh, I hear a mosquito. That's obnoxious. Anyway, <laughs> um, Knight, welcome back. Katharina, how are you doing today? Um, Rain's World, welcome on in. Let's oh, run down. Hello. Well, I hope you had a, uh, a good time, run down. I hope you had a good time. Lichy Boba, hello. Abby, welcome back. Animal Crossing 01, hello. Uh, Duddles, how are you doing today? Who else? Uh, is it Anna Umaru? Am I saying your name right? Welcome on in. Uh, Marie, thank you so much for that eight month resub. sub. I've not been able to join the stream lately. Life has been busy. I feel that. I feel that. And I hope things are like calming down or at least have, you know, been on the up and positive. But welcome back. Thank you so very much for the, uh, for the continued support. Very much appreciated. This Thursday stream, so it feels like it's been forever since I've seen you. Yes. Yeah, on Thursday we uh, we were doing some city folk, I think. Uh, and we failed to catch the scorpion, I believe. <laughs> I only just uploaded that stream this morning. I felt really bad about that. Oh gosh, there's more emotes happening. Give it a second. <laughs> Pikmin Lover. Time sure flies. Keep up the awesome work. Pikmin Lover, thank you so very much. Thank you. That is a four-month resub. Welcome back. Uh, Dimples, hello, how are you doing today? Ray Rosen, hello, welcome back. Uh, Sir Esno, decided to get into knitting and my mom is going to get me supplies for it today. Oh, that's awesome, that's awesome. It's always cool when you pick up a new hobby. Eleanor, welcome back. RJW, hello. Um, just wanna make sure I don't miss too many people here. <laughs> I think I got most people, hopefully. Fingers crossed, hi Yupdev, how's it going? Pet Pathway. Old Bush is my favorite game. <laughs> uh, two weeks off work now, so stressing down. Oh, awesome. Awesome. That is fantastic. Enjoy your time. Robert Chu, hello. Currently in a long car journey. Ooh, best of luck. Hopefully you don't, you know, get car sick. I tend to get a little bit car sick, and that's never any fun. Ando who, hello. How are you doing? I saw you in a different stream earlier this morning. Uh, Budge Monkey, hello. Who else have we got in here? I think I've said hello to everyone, and if I didn't welcome on in, you guys, I'm so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, welcome back to memory today, you guys. Today's gonna be more the same, pretty much. I want to work on... We have a couple bugs that I really want to catch. They've been eluding me for the last couple streams. That's kind of where I'm focusing on. But I also want to start getting stuff together for the various hybrids that I want to breed um, that aren't tulips, roses, and uh lilies which is all we've bred so far <laughs> so never get car sick but i did on the minibus to the airport in new york city and that was terrible yeah it's it's really not a good time when you do i'm sorry you had to experience it also hi jess rules you get sick yourself on long trips yeah i get sick if i'm reading or if i'm playing games which sucks <laughs> um i got sick once reading the fifth harry potter book on a car ride and i got sick reading or sorry playing the sims 2 ds <laughs> not fun either time uh, I'm going to grade 9 September. I'm starting high school. So my question is, do you have any tips for me for high school? Um, you know what? Honestly, I was super introverted. But if you tend to not be as shy as me, maybe try pushing yourself to get into something extracurricular, whether it be music or sports or art or some something 
outside of school time because you're more likely to make friends. I'd say a little bit faster that way. It really does depend on you, I guess, but that'd be my tip. Oh, Budweiser, thank you so much for the, uh, for the heads up. Uh, Michelle, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in. Who else have we got in here? Got your first blue rose after months. Katharina, that is awesome. Congratulations. I wish I had that type of luck. So far we haven't gotten it, but hopefully soon. Uh, Izzy, hello. Welcome on in. Uh, is it Aspen? Hello. Starting a new town today while lurking to your stream. Best of luck with the new town. Uh, Kiki Girl, hello. Got Reese's ad. Oh, got all Reese's ad before the stream. Now I want Reese's. Oh, I saw that McDonald's here in Canada has like a Reese's Pieces like McFlurry and I kind of want it. <laughs> I had a few times I got sick. But I frequently do six hour drives from my home to where I used to live. It's sadly our life now. Yeah, yeah. Ever caught in a golden stag? Uh, I think so. Pretty sure. That's one of the rare ones on the island, right? Reese's McFlurry, give me all of them, please. Yeah, they look really, really good. Really good. Um, but yeah, welcome back to memory. Last time, you guys, we finally got suggested this bench that I've been waiting legitimately months for. <laughs> Ever since we got Phoebe, so I want to say like the last seven-ish months, uh, I've been waiting for this bench and she finally suggested it. I uh, pulled up the old yellow bench that we had and I put down the white bench. I actually moved it a little bit closer to the path this time and I actually really prefer how this looks. So. Personal opinion. I really like it. Also, how's audio? Is audio okay, you guys? I know it got a bit louder when I stood up there, but let me know. Just had a UK McDonald's, as I didn't like the New York City one, and oh boy, did that tastes amazing. You know, I've heard I've heard interesting things about how McDonald's will really differ from place to place, so I'm glad you got the one you like now. <laughs> Not the Pell Tale Thursday. I'm starting to think that the Dharma's work. I need the Pedal Tale as well. That's one we're going to be after today. I love driving. I'm going to have an hour commute one way. Ooh, best of luck. I had about an hour and a half commute uh, to and from college. And that wasn't any fun, but I was also in public transit, so. <laughs> Audio is good. Awesome. Thank you, you guys. Um, Really hungry for brunch right now. Might have to get something soon. I mean, you know what? You go get your food. You do you. And tell us what you're getting as well. <laughs> you know me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, here they come, here they come. <laughs> Hylian, or Hyrule Gaming Group, is raiding us. Could we get a shout out? And Pepper, or whichever mod, would you guys mind to shout him out again once all the all the hype has died down here? Welcome on in, you guys. Hylian, how was the rest of New Leaf? You know I was lurking this morning. I was watching you uh, do some Dreamtowns, I think it was. I was watching you play online with, with people on the island, and that was fun. Oh my goodness, Ashlyn plays. Uh, Lo Lovina? Am I saying your name right? And... Oh, good. I'm gonna mispronounce this one. Uh, Kiyonoma? I don't know if I'm saying your name right. <laughs> My goodness. Welcome on in. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hylian, why? Hylian, I am not deserving. <laughs> Heisenberg's Apprentice, thank you so much for the follow as well. Hylian has just gifted five subs in the channel. Uh, Melancholy Melodies. Uh, Anna Umaru. Uh, JKP Frog? Am I saying your name right? Uh, Cupcake XOXO and J Crossovers. Thank you so much, you guys. I hope you all enjoy your your emotes and your subs. Welcome on in. Uh, night terms of service. I can't really talk about that, unfortunately. Unfortunately. <laughs> TM Cube. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in, you guys. Cube is like welcoming you guys in with me. I said it properly on the first go. Awesome. Awesome. Welcome on in, you guys. Yeah. In a little bit, once it's calmed down. If you guys don't follow Hylian, for people who were in here before, you should be. He's amazing, he's super chill. Um, I'm not really as good at shoutouts and talking in general as he is, but I try. <laughs> but yeah, welcome on in, you guys. Welcome on in. We are just starting our New Leaf stream. Uh, this is my town memory. It's about, I guess, what, eight-ish months old? Give or take, eight and a half. Um, and it's kind of my you know, pet project until March 2020 when we get Animal Crossing New Horizons. So it's kind of my very last New Leaf Town and I'm trying to make it as perfect or as perfect in my mind as I possibly can. <laughs> Thank you for lurking and I hope you have a wonderful day stream. Your shadow game is perfect. Thank you, Hylian. You are far too kind to me. Uh, Grumpy Henna? Thank you so much for the follow. And is it 
Is it clear? Thank you so much for the follow as well. Welcome on in, you guys. Sparkly, hello. Welcome back. Random Ian, hello. How are you doing? I'm sorry you've been stressed out with school. Sorry, chat's moving up. Let me try and read this. Only be able to attend weekend streams, which means I'm going to miss episode 100 of this series. Oh, actually, that's true. That's coming up real quick. <laughs> uh, welcome back, though. I'm sorry that, you know, things haven't been going so well. Um... Uh, Pumas, no worries, but thank you so much for for stopping by. Also, Mayor Brandon, hello, hello. Welcome on in, you guys. Welcome on in. How was the fair? Oh, the fair was great. If you guys are just jumping in, um, I had the day off yesterday. Mike and I went to uh, kind of like the end of uh, end of summer fair that we do here in Toronto, and it was a lot of fun. We ate probably too many sweet and bad things, and it was it was chill. It was chill. I got two new keyblades, which I'm super hyped about. I have to find out. How to mount them properly. <laughs> Waiting for after hype, but I'm hoping to get a little McDonald's today, of course. It's a magnet to me. Oh heck yeah, you enjoy that McDonald's. Enjoy that McDonald's. But yeah guys, welcome on in. Uh, what we're going to be doing today is our usual dailies. We have to make sure our villagers are all happy and taken care of and not wanting to move because my goodness, I, I can't plot reset anymore. <laughs> um, as well as I have a couple bugs in particular that I need to catch for our museum and 100%ing that. So, Helene, you relax. You do really long streams. I still don't know how you do it. Uh, and you more than deserve <laughs> some downtime. Oh, Starry and Alex, thank you! Thank you! I- oh, gosh, they're so pretty. I really like them. Luca, hello! How are you doing? Welcome back. Check my follower count? On here, you mean? Ooh, wow, that's crazy. <laughs> I'm not gonna say it out loud, because that makes me a little bit nervous, but... Ooh, okay. <laughs> Luna, it's been a quiet day today. It's been very quiet. Um, I'm a little bit tired after yesterday, so... I played a little bit of Stardew this morning. I was lurking pretty much the entire morning in Hylian stream, and uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. All right, then, you guys. So let's go ahead and check our letters. Uh, so we did buy a painting last time. I think it's the neutral painting, and it's one that we did need for the museum, which is fantastic. Oh, perfect, Lester. Best of luck with college. I I know. I every single year, even even beyond the first year, I would get really stressed before I started. So. I wish you all the best. <laughs> you got this. Uh, dear Cousin Crystal, Old Red wants to thank you for coming by Red's Gallery and purchasing a very fine neutral painting. This delivery completes your purchase. All sales final. <laughs> I love how he has to write that down. Okay, so that's awesome. I've been playing a Stardew for the last two days and I regret nothing. Yeah, I've been bouncing back and forth between Pokemon Y and Stardew recently and that's kind of like been my jam. Uh, Dear Crystal, sorry for barging my way in the other day. Please take this with my apologies. You already have everything you need, so it's time to focus on what you want. I, I appreciate that, Astrid. <laughs> I actually do. Uh, going to be watch. Going to watch Love Simon with a friend later, even though the movie came out a little bit ago. Uh, a club I managed showing it. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. I hope you enjoy. Hi, PSK. How are you doing? Welcome on in. Also, Gigi, hello, how are you doing today? I'm not sure if I said hello, and I'm sorry if I'm missing anyone in here. Happy to catch at least your stream today a bit before heading out to work, since I think majority of this coming week I won't be able to make other streams. That's okay, Cruel World. Best of luck with uh, with work. I hope you have a relatively straightforward week and they don't doesn't stress you out too much. Uh, hello, Crystal. I bought this by mistake the first time my mom sent me on an errand. It's all beat up and sad looking now, so I want you to have it. I'm sure you can make it happy again. Oh, Eric. Eric is such a sweetheart. Uh, Bilzelia, hello, how are you doing? Welcome back. In persona, hello. Plotter said it, and a villager didn't appear to be moving in. Started up as my mayor, and Samson plot himself right on my bed of red and white roses. Yeah, it- Sometimes that'll happen, and it's so, so frustrating. Got a lily pad table. Uh, Kawaii Gamer Sophie, hello! Welcome on in from YouTube. How are you doing today? Surprise for Crystal, I know this is out of the blue, but the other day I found the perfect present for you. This time I'm confident you'll like it. Really confident. I kept the receipt, let me know. <laughs> Midges me when I'm sending stuff, oh my goodness. Uh, Ramshackle Floor, thank you, Midge. Cool, so... 
Eight chairs a dog for that reason? Same. Same. She plotted herself right onto my uh, Pokeball made out of roses. And lilies, I think, maybe, in the last town? Or was it just lilies? It's been a while. So it's the bug off, but we already actually won it last time, so I'm probably not going to bother today. Midge. <laughs> Midge is amazing. Oh, Ian, I hope your cousin has a fantastic birthday. Oh no, Dagger, is it not acting right again? Anyone have any tips on getting the Pond Skater Bug and the Diving Beetle? I'm having trouble finding them. Um, finding them, I definitely say, you know, make use of save and continue because that does refresh your town. Um, catching them, I'm terrible at. I, I really hate catching those ones. What's up with the 5 p.m. gameplay? So the Petal Tail Dragonfly is only available between 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. So that's kind of why I started it now and I'm hoping we'll find it as we're walking around. Try getting second or third. Actually, that's actually an interesting idea, collecting all the trophies. I like that. I might do that. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, Alright, let's donate this. Oh, Bree Berries, thank you so very much for the host. How are you doing today? Welcome back. Neutral painting. Cool. So now that can be crossed off our list. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Which, by the way, if you guys are new here and you want to see the list that I'm referring to, you can type in exclamation mark museum. It's going to lead you to essentially like a Google sheet of, um, of all the paintings and deep sea creatures and bugs and fish that I have left, um, as well as tools, songs, and flowers. Everything that I'm working on to in my mind, complete the town, essentially. After that horrible video, I honestly don't care. I just want some wholesome content to forget that unruly animation I just watched. I'm scared like no joke. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'm not gonna ask too much then. Have you interesting day at work? The fire alarm went off and my coworkers and I were stuck inside for an hour. So our manager got mad at everyone for evac- Wait, okay. Wait, they got mad at you for evacuating when there was a fire alarm? Okay, there must be something you can, like, report, or someone who you can report that to, because that's a little bit crazy. Okay, I'm also going to update my dream address now, I think. Um, I usually only update it on days that I stream. <laughs> um, so, just so you guys can have it if you'd like it. Thank you, random. I've been in lurk mode, and so many people join the stream. Hello, everyone. I'm sorry. I'm busy doing some art. Ark, you do your art. It's cool. It's all cool. Ah, uh, viewing only. Very careful if you're looking for Animal Crossing animations or plain old don't do it. People are dark as heck. <laughs> yeah. The animal- you see, I have, a, I have a theory that when a game as light and as friendly as Animal Crossing, if people can make something dark out of it, it just seems like ten times worse because <laughs> of what the original game is. It's very light, it's very friendly. Last time I visited your town it looked like spring. You mean this town, Lindenbach? Because I do update it every, every stream. But maybe it just looked like spring, who knows. <laughs> Next time the fire alarm goes off, CC tells the manager they have to stay inside. Oh my goodness, random. No real fire, it's just the fire detector malfunctioning. He's mad at everyone. But what if it was? Like, how are you guys supposed to know that? Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> um, but yeah, yesterday was fun, you guys. Um, Mike and I did go to that end of summer fair. Um, we ate too much. There was a whole lot of, uh, in general, farm animals that we got to see as well, because uh, this fair does have its roots in... It used to be more of like an agricultural sort of fair. These days it's not really, but um, there are still some farm animals that we got to see and there was these cute little piggies and it was fun. And there's also a gaming section, which is really cool. Um, okay, so fireworks tomorrow night. I think that's all that we missed. Need your help with something I really want to play Kingdom Hearts for the first time ever. What exact game title would you recommend for... Oh, okay. So, for the first time ever, I wouldn't say pick up anything on DS or 3DS. Um, you're gonna be lost. If you want to start Kingdom Hearts, I definitely recommend picking up uh, Kingdom Hearts 1 or Kingdom Hearts 1.5, 2.5 on the PS4 or PS3. Um, or PS2 if you have that as well, I guess. 
Um, it, it's definitely worth your buy if you're looking to get into the series, but because of how complex of a series it is, jumping in in the middle is, like, not really recommended. <laughs> Lumi, I did! Yeah, I was lurking in there. Bob, hello! If you guys are new, also Bob is kind of worshipped here. He's our favorite. <laughs> we have several emotes of him. He's plastered all over my streams. Uh, he's the one who'll greet you if you follow or sub or anything like that, usually. It's a, it's a little bit of an obsession. Oh, Panda Lover! <laughs> that was probably from when I was making my, uh, my orchard with the stumps. How do you get rid of villagers without amiibo? The best thing you can do, uh, and it sounds counterintuitive, is to befriend them, and then eventually they will ask to move out. Um, I think that's just the best way to do it without amiibos. Oh, Sassy Summer, very nice! I really enjoy the night market in Stardew. Uh, do you know Mike? I see him, I definitely think new face, but am I totally off base? I agree if you could get to know him better and report back to me. Oh boy. Sparkly, 100%, 100%. What days do I stream Stardew? Generally, we only have one day of, of Stardew per week, which is on Fridays, but that just occasionally I'll do like a late stream of Stardew or something like that. Emma, no worries, how are you doing? Welcome back. <laughs> Hey, Uma, exactly, exactly. I don't really like Chain of Memories too much either. Uh, I'm gonna end today's bug off on a high note by nabbing a gigantic bug. Heck yeah, Cube, you do you. Smoking in the school toilets to try and set off the alarm. Missed out on a test though, oh boy. <laughs> oh, Cece, thank you. 17 months. In other news, I survived the fake fire, woo! <laughs> I love it. Oh, uh, love in chat, you guys. Love in chat. And if you guys are new here, you don't have to use love emotes from my channel. You can use it from other people's channels. You can use the standard Twitch emotes. Whatever you got is more than welcome. <laughs> Tip stash. <laughs> That's all I had to say. So, you want to talk to me? Well, what do you think of my furniture? It's well loved, right? I agree. Uh, so he asked us for the tarantula one day. Alright, listen, I I don't make the rules, but Gaston wants, Gaston gets. <laughs> so. You guys are wondering why that's there. Disney Magical World. I heard it's like Animal Crossing, but Disney Incorporated. I haven't. I haven't even heard of it. I'm not gonna lie. Also, Trixie, thank you so very much for that Twitch Prime sub. I hope you enjoyed the emotes. Welcome on in. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> um, more love in chat, if you guys could. Okay, so that was intimidating. Don't take out your axe first thing, Crystal. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and see if I can't find fossils around town to start off um and if you guys see any fossils that i maybe walk by and don't notice other than random in chat <laughs> let me know because honestly i'm, I'm kind of blind uh nisha crossing hello by the way how are you doing today gunblade lad hello what gaston wants is to take over my mayor job and break into my home i'm always catching him talking about digging tunnels and trying my front door <laughs> listen all right gaston is He's special. <laughs> uh, there isn't much time left in the bug off, so give it all you've got. You may be rivals in this tournament, but I'll always cheer on my friends. Oh my goodness, Midge is just the sweetest thing. Like, why is she so good to us? The random Hannah, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in. Um, so I have a couple things here that I should probably just sell before I actually start going around town or else my inventory is going to fill up. Kind of late, but speaking of Stardew, didn't we leave off on a cliffhanger? We did, we did. We were just before the Dance of the Moonlight Jellies, which is my favorite event in Stardew, and I'm really looking forward to it when we go back. Oh, did I misspell something, Pepper? Yeah, you're more than welcome to. Whatever you guys want to do. <laughs> I didn't realize I misspelled something. Ah, oh, it's easy. I'm glad I'm not the only one who thought of that song. <laughs> oh, Dagger, I did not. I'm sorry to hear about that. That's not fun. Is Mitch becoming third favorite? Mitch has always been kind of a favorite. She's actually the first villager I ever spoke to in any Animal Crossing game. She was the very first one. And I do have a soft spot for her. Nisha Crossing, you enjoy your stardew? Enjoy your lurk? Oh, 
Bug off is today. I'm getting my DS. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it is today. No worries, Pepper. You guys, like, anytime you see anything like that, you're more than welcome to edit. It's all good. Oh, leaves and le Oh, okay, I see. I see. Oh, wait, was that a fossil back there? No, I'm just blind. Okay. Um, <laughs> my apologies, Pepper. I was so cool he met you ending the stream the day before the Moonlight Jellies. I know, I know. I had to leave it there, though. We were getting later that night. Don't give up even if there's only one second left. Keep at it. That's true sportsmanship. I like how Cube is just like creeping on Gaston's house back here. <laughs> you enjoy that, Tony. No worries. No worries. If you guys are just lurking and hanging out, that is more than appreciated. Um, oh, Phoebe. How are you doing? Phoebe has earned herself massive brownie points in my town for suggesting that one bridge that I've been trying to get for months. <laughs> uh, holding my net hand- or sorry, my net holding hand is sore. How about you? You okay? Let's keep out until the very end. Can't get over how perfect the wooden bridge is though. I really like the wooden bridge. I've- I don't think I've used that one before actually, but it- it fits really, really well. What happened to the Animal Crossing category? What do you mean, Linda Buck? Also, Risa, thank you so very much for that tier one sub. Thank you. Enjoy the emotes. Welcome on into the sub club. Thank you very much. You guys are being far, far too generous today, and I really wish I had, like, <laughs> I don't know. I wish I could say something more. I wish I could do something more. But thank you guys very much. Uh, where are they putting red ones again? I don't even remember. Here. Will villagers ping you during the bug off? I don't think they will. I think they might after the event is over, but I could be wrong on that one. Maybe is queen and I will hunt down every single one of you who disrespects her. I mean, what if she disrespected me first, though? I think I just saw Eric. Oh, yeah, I just saw him run by with his net. <laughs> Almost to my second year on Stardew also, which I could subscribe, but I'm broke. It's fine, it's fine. I'm just happy you're here, honestly. I'm happy you guys are here and chatting with me. Uh, welcome, Blueberry. <laughs> I forgot we changed it. Make yourself at home. Uh, didn't I hear you say you really wanted- ooh. Sure, why not? <laughs> Pepper, I do, I do. Looking around the rooms for my kittens, because they're cute. One is in the cat tower. Didn't see the other at first, was getting worried, found her sleeping on the stairs. Aw, oh, cats always have a weird thing about sleeping on stairs, don't they? It makes me nervous. Hi, PG Merman, how are you doing? Welcome back. Only bugs I need is the ones that I can get. Um, for my second town. They're iconic for my fashion check and the clothes I can use once I'm wearing my first town. Oh, I see. I see, Mary Brandon. Was there any way you could. Swap- well, I guess you need two, two 3DSs or something like that to swap between them, right? Bug off, it's almost over. I didn't have much time left to catch a ginormous pug. Or sorry, I don't. You were an exception, but it shall not happen again. Alright, that's fair. Hi Alex, how are you doing? Welcome back. Um, alright, so... Astrid, how are you doing? I went on one of my crazy shopping sprees and I bought something I didn't even want. Do you consider buying a vertigo tea for me? Sure, you know what? Why not? I'm listening to Spirit's Eve year two and this time I'm not going to leave the jack-o'-lantern out to rot in winter. Yes. Best not do that. Go Eric, you can do it. <laughs> no worries, Saucy Simmer. You take your time. Three yeses, so I just went over my second time, changed my clothes, and gave them. Oh, okay, perfect, perfect. I know, like, I know a couple people. Actually, I know a lot of people who have multiple 3DS systems, but obviously not everyone does. Um, 
So I figured, you know, I might as well ask. <laughs> Hear about my shower issue, Crystal? I tried to wash my hair in the bath, but covered in- Oh no, Pepper! Um, <clears throat> let me see here. Latisse is continuing the gift stub they got from PG. Thank you so very much, Latisse. It's not gonna pop up on screen, but I thank you so much anyway. Um, okay, so this area is all good. When I go to voice chat and Discord, I get a little nervous. What do I do to make me feel comfortable? I just say keep going, keep chatting, get used to it. And if it really makes you feel uncomfortable, no one's forcing you to. You can just hang out and chill on mute and chat with people via text. Oh, Alex, yeah, I really enjoyed myself. It was a lot of fun. And Pokemon Girl, welcome back. Uh, yesterday at the fair was a lot of fun. Mike and I kind of had like a... I guess for the most part we weren't really even on our phones, we just kind of were focusing on the moment, which is really nice. Um, usually we both have our phones out and are doing something. Love the Mitch and Bob emote combo, it looks so precious and aesthetically pleasing, I'm glad you enjoy those. Uh, and actually those two were made by two of my mods, which I am super proud of. People can art, I can't art. <laughs> I am missing three fossils. <laughs> so if you guys see them, let me know. I'm blind. Wait, I found one. I, I can see this one. Oh, tell me about that one. Want the new 3DS for the ability to move me both as a reader thing? Yes, yeah. It's very, very handy. Um, and apparently finding those amiibo reader, like the external ones these days is actually really hard. At least that's what I've heard. Starting to feel better after getting your wisdom teeth removed. I'm happy. Ooh. I'm happy you're feeling better. Uh, or starting to. Oh, Random Hannah, I think I found the one you were talking about. Thank you for that. Also, hoi, Max. How are you doing? Okay, so this area is good. So we are down to only one fossil missing. Second hand shop. Yeah, like I, I'm really happy I got mine, you know, from the Happy Home Designer bundle thing because it, it just made such a huge difference. Also, it's missing for an actual weeks. I find three, you call today, Charisma. Yes, I've been in that situation before. So that's when I call over Ark and I'm like, all right, you look at it. <laughs> you try and find it. Um, okay, so I don't know where I was putting yellow ones, but. The white and purple rose is such a beautiful combination. Yeah, I really like purples, purples, blues, and whites. I really enjoy And If I could fill my entire town with just those colors, I would, but I don't know. Sometimes I like uh, a little bit of variety. Um, ooh, hello. Where are the fossils? <laughs> no worries, Gloomy, no worries. Take your time. Um, cool. All right, so. Nothing there, and no blue rose yet. But we are working on it. Eventually it will happen. We'll just start now. I already have 200 essays to type. Junior year is whack. <laughs> Best of luck, Max. Best of luck. Oh, okay, girl. Best of luck. Have a fantastic day if, you know, if at all possible. Gosh, I don't know. I, I know a lot of you in chat work at jobs where, you know, they can call you in at any time and be like, hey, we need you here. I don't think I could handle that. Um, like my, I'm, I'm kind of the person where, you know, I have my set work hours and I work during that time. And then any time after that or before that is like, you do, no, <laughs> don't, don't call, don't bother. I'm probably not going to answer. I can't deal with it. Um, so more kudos to you guys. Um, all right. And then... Right there. It opens, gotta enjoy your food. Um, where was I putting yellow? I don't know where I was putting yellow, so I'm gonna put it. Or, no, I have white. Where was I putting white ones? I was putting these somewhere. Did 
They was meant to be off, but I knew they would call me because we had a lot of work. Yeah. Nope, can't work by. <laughs> um, well, I was putting the white ones here at least. I can replace this one finally. So I was the only day that I'm free from that gosh darn phone. Yeah. Yeah. See, I... Ugh. More power to you guys. Jonas, hello, how are you doing? Welcome back. Thank you myself up to ask for a raise. I'm gonna get ready. <laughs> Kiki Girl, best of luck. Best of luck. I, I've had to do that before. It's a little bit intimidating. Try to call me in a lot and I say no every time. I don't know why they keep trying when they already know the answer. <laughs> See, I think with me though, you know, I, internally I'd want to say no, like, you know, I have something today or whatever, but I'd really feel rude saying no, but that's just me. That's just entirely me wanting to be a people pleaser, wanting to always say yes, so. I'm so stressed out about it. One looks really good and it's not expensive at all, but I feel like it's a fraud. Oh, be careful, merman. Be careful, but, you know, best of luck. <laughs> Is it rude that I don't even answer when I get called in? I mean, that's more likely what I would do if I wanted to, like, avoid, you know, saying no, is I would just avoid the call altogether. Oh, Mike is coming over. He says he has input. <laughs> so, when I had to get do the whole call-in thing, they had a, I'm not sure for you guys, but for me, there was a, a, a minimum time or a, or a maximum, whatever you want to call it, you had to call in by, mm -hmm. right? Or that you could. So the maximum I could call in was two hours before shift. So if you called in like two and a half hours, it'd say, okay, call back again in half an hour. Mm -hmm. So every single time I would always call in exactly two hours before shift. I knew that no one called in two hours before shift when they weren't gonna come in. Oh gosh. And then I wouldn't go in and then they would need someone. <laughs> but yeah, I always called at the very maximum, but they never called me. I wasn't, it wasn't a job where they Oh, give me a second, you guys. Two seconds. And there we go. <laughs> Perfect. We are back. Sorry about that, you guys. Um, so it, I've been hearing rumbling for like the last 30 minutes and I was just like, oh, it's like a truck outside. No, that's thunder. Um, so we had a brief power cut. It came up immediately back online, but I had to get my computer back up and we had an update. So <laughs> sorry about that. Oh, that really sucks. I'm, I'm sorry for people who left. And the first part of the stream has corrupted, so I have to go back and download it, which sucks. But anyways, <laughs> welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. Um, if I go down again, assume that the power has been cut again due to weather, and I will, like, you know, probably not come back online. But, but I'm back again. Um, and hopefully it stays up this time. Anyways, <laughs> um, we had just finished handing in our fossils. We were talking about how you know, you deal with being called into work or having to call in ahead of time or stuff like that. But what I want to do is I want to go see if we can't find all my villagers right now really quickly. Um, just to make sure that they're all happy and good and, and loving life here in memory. <laughs> What's my dream address? Exclamation mark DA in chat. Exclamation mark DA. There you go. Pepper just typed in for you. That is how you can find my most up-to-date dream address and uh, it does get updated, you know, if my dream address changes, for example. Oh, Pokemon Girl, that's adorable. Did you give your kitty cat anything for her birthday? Mike's too powerful. Yeah, Mike came over, started rambling, and then, of course, Evigora's power went down. <laughs> oh, did it freeze for you briefly? I haven't dropped any frames. I haven't dropped any frames, so maybe try refreshing if it's acting kind of funny. Um, but yeah, anyways. Where are all my villagers at? Who haven't we spoken to you yet? Oh, actually, will they hang out in the museum if there's a bug off going on right now? I don't know if they'll come up here if there's an event. It was Emma's fault she came back with food. <laughs> Wet food. Oh, very nice. 
Every time something happens to stream, I assume it's your shoddy internet. Yet yeah, normally, normally we're pretty good. We're pretty stable. We don't really drop any frames. And like, you know, I'm going to knock on wood here because I know Hylian has been in, uh, suffering essentially through, you know, weird drops and stuff like that. And that really sucks. And I don't want that to happen to us. And I hope that you get that fixed soon if he's still in here. I hope the power enjoyed its outing and completed its Pokemon Go decks. Bought a tablet yesterday just to download the Twitch app and watch the stream while my baby's awake. Oh, creative emulator. <laughs> I hope baby and you are doing well. First I thought I was just lagging due to internet connection. Yeah, I was a little bit confused when suddenly both of my monitors went dark and I was like, excuse you? Found everyone in town today and none on Main Street? Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing that they're probably not up here today. Having luck with shiny hunting and let's go. No, you know what? I really wanted to get a shiny Eevee and I was chaining for Eevees, but Eevees are really hard to catch in that game. Uh, and I broke the chain both times before I reached 31, which was upsetting, but hopefully, hopefully soon. <laughs> Cat miss? Oh, that's adorable. Alrighty, so fossils are done. I uh, don't have to worry about those. I should probably put away my axe, honestly. I'm not chopping down any trees right now. Watch as I need to chop down a tree later on on stream. <laughs> Nothing shall stop the Animal Crossing New Leaf stream. <laughs> I was I was really confused as well why my monitors went dark and then my 3DS didn't and then I'm like it's a battery powered thing of course it didn't go down. Ah, uh, storm saints. I don't think we did. I don't think we did. Also, I don't really need my uh my diving suit right now either. Um balloon, you don't need to be there. All right, cool. Let's just go ahead and sell off everything. The more of the species you catch, the easier it gets. Yes, I learned that uh, with Chanseys, actually, and Let's Go. It made it really easy after a while to just catch them. So I hope the more I catch, the better it gets. And you just specifically have to catch Eevee, I think. Just do a long Pidgey chain. Yeah, no, I've, I've heard of that. I just, I want it to be easy to catch Eevee so that I can really quickly get Shinies for them. But I, I know I could just chain anything else, really. We should play Let's Go together sometime. I still need to complete my decks. Max, hit me up. I got two different save files. I could send you Pokemon on. <laughs> I offered to sing for everyone, but you came back. Pepper, I saw. I, I immediately booted up stream on, uh, or stream chat on, uh, on my, uh, data on my phone. Dinoko, thank you so much for the host. How are you doing today? Really want shiny Eevee, but every time I go for want another shiny of here has got my shiny ponytail and jigglypuff that way? Yep. Yep. <laughs> I know that feeling. Uh, cool. Alright, so that is all good. Let's go ahead and go shopping, and then I want to come back down into town and start searching around for that petal tail dragonfly, which should be very large. It's only available for two hours out of the day, which is kind of crazy. Oh, Linda, back. That's awesome. Congrats on not getting, uh, not getting caught by that tarantula. Sophie, best of luck with the new town. Best of luck. Do you have any ideas for the name just yet? Okay. So, we need more fertilizer. This is for our, um, our blue rose. And then I'm also going to buy some more bamboo. Because I want to use bamboo somewhere in town. I'm just not really sure where yet. I have a slight idea. Ooh, I just saw a flash. It's like, it's weird. It's cloudy, but it's bright here. But it's been rumbling to itself. I don't know if you guys just heard that. <laughs> if it goes down again, assume it's my power. I'm so sorry. KK Fair. Do we need this one? We might. We do, actually. So if you guys, once again, are just joining us. You guys heard that? Yeah. It's It's been noisy. Um... Exclamation mark museum, you guys can see which songs we're missing as well. We're trying to collect all those. At least it wasn't your tummy thing. Goodness. 
Uh, and gumbo. Do I already have that one? I think I might. Oh, no, I don't. Yeah, Tommy Raccoon Flash Nintendo Store in New York City is able, able to see wild raccoons, which we don't have. Oh my goodness, you guys don't have raccoons over there? Raccoons are beautiful trash pandas. <laughs> oh, RJW, yes, I'm very well versed with, uh, with bamboo. I'm gonna have some designs down to keep it in line. Hi, Random Uma, welcome back. I kind of want to get an old TV like this for our gaming section so that I could, like, have my old gaming consoles represented as well. There's a Pokemon Center opening up in London. Yeah, it's like a pop-up one, isn't it? I hope you guys enjoy it for those who are gonna go check it out. Um... Ooh! You changed your stuff. Wait, 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 wait. This is different than usual. It's not what I wanted, but it's different. <laughs> no, Pepper, if you did, I've forgotten. Raccoons are adorable. I should collect all songs. That's not a thing I've ever tried to do yet. Yeah, neither have I, actually, and I'm really interested in seeing if we can do it. Raccoons are cute but deadly. They're just adorable. They're just just the cutest thing. Yeah, I know you guys have foxes, which is- we have foxes over here too, but they're not, like, that common. Saw three- two were babies and one was mama. They were big babies. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. And you're annoying when you have a garden? Yes, they will- they will go through and they'll eat everything. <laughs> really want any of that. We have hedgehogs, they're the most precious babies. Oh! <laughs> badgers are very mean and not cute enough. Like, yeah, badgers, like, honestly, I think they're kind of cute, but I know they can be kind of, kind of vicious. Yeah, foxes are loud. Yeah. Um, okay, so there's that done. We got our shopping. I'm gonna go ahead and use this fertilizer. Now, I know I want to use bamboo somewhere in town, and I know I have to be kind of careful about where I put it because it can grow everywhere. Do you guys have any suggestions for where you'd like to see bamboo in town? I still have raccoons until my town was attacked by a few when I went camping. Oh no! I'm sorry to hear they kind of went after you there. On the beach. They won't grow on the beach, but that would be, you know, interesting if they did. At least I don't think they'll grow on the beach. Is there a big empty space? Because that would be nice to fill in with bamboo. So, this is like, this area right here is kind of like my big empty, I don't know what I'm doing with it space. Oh my goodness, Pepper. <laughs> um... I also have, like, I could make, like, a wall dividing these two areas in half. And also this area down here, maybe? Um, does anyone want to remind me, are bamboo, like, trees? They can't grow beside each other, I'm assuming. We look li like the look of cut bamboo? Yes, cut bamboo is something I want to use in this town as well. They can. Okay, wait, there has to be one space between them. I'm getting conflicting news here. Uh, is it Romeo? Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Surround Rossetti with bamboo. <laughs> I just thought it would look kind of nice if just like this line up here. I don't know, Pepper. I'm not sure either. And then like maybe this line up here. Because the rumbles are so loud, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know, some, something like that, maybe. Have I heard of VR chat? Um, I think I've heard of, like, I don't know if you call them games, but games that do that. 
Um, I've never participated. I don't have anything VR. Oh. I use bamboo field in my town top left corner, surrounded by, surrounded by moss-covered stones to stop the spreading. Yes, yeah. And a small pond. That's interesting. That's really cute. The boo grows under the same conditions as trees and cannot grow adjacent to another tree, object, or bamboo. I'm assuming Star Cherry got that from the wiki. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm just gonna fill in this space here. So, I believe what the rules of bamboo are, if I'm remembering correctly. He plays clovers on the beach. Uh, I don't know, actually. You might be able to. I'm sure she's fancy with her words. <laughs> Would rainbow roses or rainbow tulips look better on the beach? Um, roses have more color variety, so I'd say roses personally. And by that, I mean they have like blue. <laughs> Clovers are okay on the beach. Um, Haley, thank you so very much for the uh, for the host. Welcome back. So what I was thinking for bamboo. Oh my goodness, the rumbles! <laughs> uh, is put one here. I'd have to chop down this tree, I think. Oh no! Gosh darn it, me. I done messed up. Oh, that's upsetting. Well, one here. One here, ooh. I guess I could only have three here then, because I can't have one up against this fence, I don't think. Um, and then again, you know, one here, this cherry tree would have to move. One here. Uh, and then one there. And just kind of, I don't know, cordon off this section. Um, and you'd be able to see it from here. Uh, Nisha, it might just be you. It might just be you. Um, I, I haven't dropped any frames. <laughs> At least it wasn't the rock, yes. Um, so I actually do need my axe today after I just put it away. Oh, Alex, you enjoy your birthday. You have the best day. Is he study for you? Yeah, I think it's I think it's just Twitch being twitchy at this point. Oh, Star Cherry, I hope she has an amazing birthday as well. There's a lot of birthdays this month, I feel like. Oh, Dagger. That is like the biggest compliment. <laughs> People bringing their doggies to my town, that's the hugest compliment you could ever give me. Oh my goodness, the rumbles, please. Calm yourself, Mother Nature. It's, it's fine. Audio's kind of funky for you. Is anyone else having weird audio? I wonder if something's going on. Oh, Padfoot, yeah. No, I feel that. Okay, so this tree needs to go. Uh-oh. Great. Great, cool. <sighs> oh, they came around from the back. <laughs> Audio's fine, okay. Not the bees. Look at my face. Okay. We need to go talk to Phoebe after this arc is absolutely right. Pikmin lover, you're getting thunder as well? Yeah. Yeah, Nisha, maybe it's just a weird connection thing, honestly. I wish I could help though. I hate it when my when my you know sounds and stuff are off, as you guys know. Did I have my axe, please? Thank you. I was gonna say if that's another net <laughs> or another uh, another beehive, I should say. You myself straight into that police station. That would have been a smart person's idea. I'm not smart. <laughs> Those cherries just disappear. Don't worry about it. It's fine. What a way to conclude the bug off, yep. 
Oh well, it's okay. Okay, good stuff. So yeah, it's gonna look something something like that. Um, I think it'll look interesting. So what I know about bamboo is it'll spread anywhere in the, I think, what is that, eight spaces surrounding it. So if those eight spaces are surrounded by flowers, theoretically no bamboo should spawn. Am I correct in thinking that, you guys? Maybe? Hopefully? Oh, Papa, that's pretty cool. And I still don't have the bees. Oh no, I had one. <laughs> Not eight, it's one spot further. One spot further. Okay, so as long as everything around it is covered twice, essentially. So over here is essentially fine, but this side, this side is not. This side is in danger of bamboo spreading. Mm, okay, I'm just gonna put down these right here just to make sure that we're all good. Oh, gosh, I hate it when it does that. <laughs> oh, Lindebach, what'd you learn? What'd you learn? Also, could you please? The beeping. I don't appreciate the beeping. I wish there was a way to mute this thing, really. Just put flowers everywhere. Yep, Amy, hope for the best. <laughs> Once you grow bamboo, we'll start spawning around. Sorry, under, and you dig it up like a fossil. Yeah, no, I... I don't think it'll destroy flowers. I believe it'll just... You know spawn in place. I think, from what I remember about bamboo. Um, cause I know, I had it kind of spread around one of my towns a while ago. It was really bad. The Iridium Springs low range, yes. That's a good way to put it. <laughs> um, okay, so... Bamboo. I did buy- there we go, I did buy another one. You access the catalog in order to stop the linden buck. Which catalog do you mean? The only one I know of that you can like access access is like in Timmy and Tommy's store. Also, you guys better get used to my face looking like this for the entirety of the stream now. There we go. So, when these are fully grown, it would be really handy if they could just spawn another one behind them that I could then plant into this space and then this space. <laughs> Misguided him. <laughs> it's true. Oh, that's beautiful. But yeah, I think it'll look quite nice once it's done. Um, and then another thing I might do, just to give Rossetti a little bit more of his own area, is plant a pine tree here. And I'm gonna get rid of these, unfortunately here so I don't think that's not gonna bother um, anything and just give him his own little his own little area these things happen Padfa, I'm not sure if I want to chop them into stumps or not but it's very tempting because I do like the look of them uh, rundown yeah it is uh, it is perfect town status oh actually I think I have some saplings saved up so I had a GameCube growing up, or at least a 3DS. My only Animal Crossing experience is playing the original at a friend's house years ago in Pocket Camp now. Oh my goodness, yes. The GameCube was... It's my childhood console. It's one of my favorites, but... Um, are you planning, or do you have a Switch? Are you planning on getting uh, New Horizons by any chance? There's one. And there's two. Not your current situation. That's understandable. That's understandable. I hope one day you're able to experience it. Um, I know a lot of people really want the Switch to get a virtual console on it for GameCube, and I know there would be a huge demand for Animal Crossing GameCube to be put on there, so you could essentially, you know, two birds with one stone if in the future you ever are able to get a Switch.
There we go. Something, something like that I think will work just fine. Um, cool. So we have two new music tracks to play. Game Store has new horizons on display. Is ready to pre-order? Yeah, I've seen Pokemon Sword and Shield and Luigi's Mansion 3 like out on the shelves already. And I think it's I think it's just placeholder box art, or maybe it's not, maybe it's real. Either way, I keep looking at it and I'm like, I see you. <laughs> oh Amy, I'm good. Thank you so much for that though. Thank you so much for the offer. <laughs> Simpsons didn't, yeah, Simpsons didn't run. I know a lot of people would want that one, of course. Oh, whoops. Not what I meant to do. I don't, do I recognize this song? Oh, yes, I do. <laughs> Took me until that to recognize it. Oh man, I thought we already had that one too. I have it on my list. I, I done messed up. Oh well. I'll just store it in case someone wants it. Actually, that song is really... Too high energy for me. <laughs> Plain white cover with logo in the middle, but I'm still keeping my eyes on it. Yeah. <laughs> yep, I know that feeling. Um, and I can just sell that. Gosh, it's actually like, it's getting sunny here. It's like blue skies, you can see them peeking through, but I still hear that rumbling of thunder every, like, two minutes, if that. Hi, Rosie, how are you doing? Welcome back. The Benton, uh, you can get music in two ways. Either when you have Club LOL built, if you go there, I think after 8 p.m. on Saturday nights, uh, KK Slider will be playing and you can get a song from him, or... When you upgrade uh, Timmy and Tommy's store, they'll start to sell uh, CDs or, or records or whatever you want to call them. Um, alright. Let me go ahead and sell off this stuff that I don't need. Oh, Jacob, best of luck, best of luck. Oh my goodness, Sophie. <laughs> okay, uh, no, I actually want that. And those actually sell for a decent amount. Yes, my face hurts, but like, otherwise... <laughs> this is just great and we... Right, ignore that. Pretend that you didn't see that. <laughs> Replace thermal... Ooh, no, ugh. We had to deal with thermal paste when we were putting together uh, my computer, and uh, that was a little bit intimidating to watch. I didn't do it personally. Why is that still there? We don't ask questions here, Adam. <laughs> or Andrew, my apologies. I was thinking of Adam just now. Ooh. Midge. I caught it. Okay, Legend, I'm doing good. How about you? I spilled, spilled some thermal paste on my motherboard when I tried. Oh, gosh. Yep. <laughs> Always an issue. Add more fruits to New Horizons. What would you add? I say grapes. Vines would be so pretty. Strawberries, for me personally. But it would have to be from, like... Um... Uh, from, like, a bush, maybe? It's Mitch's net. Now I got a bug. <laughs> oh, I love it. It was fine until it broke. I mean, that's that's very relatable. What was I doing again? Great. I don't need a flea on me. And blueberries, yeah, like blueberries, strawberries, like these things. I could definitely see them in um, on bushes. I think it'd be really, really cute. Yeah, Tony, they kind of sparkle, which is really pretty. Mm. 
Oh, I finally heard the tattoo and I saw a bad romance as a tattoo. Playing for him. Oh no. Merman. Asking Legend, not too much. We actually went down earlier because of uh, my power going out because we're having a bit of a storm outside, but otherwise. Otherwise, it's been good. I think I'm gonna go ahead and check out the, uh, the award ceremony and see who won here, you guys. Oh no, Rossi, I'm sorry to hear about that. Pokemon Worlds. Oh, is it? Is it being toxic? It's not bad. I guess every community has their toxic people, I guess, right? Midge! Heck yeah, Midge, you do good. Good girl. Oh, you mean the shirt I'm wearing? This is uh, a custom design made by uh, Random and Chad. It's uh, it's a rainbow Eggman jacket. Kevin, Kevin, you always do good, buddy. You got this. Look at you. I really want you to change your shirt, but otherwise you're you're heckin' cute. Pineapples. That'd be interesting. Be very interesting. Add to your New Horizons town with the placing furniture outside feature. Um, I don't know about features, but just more stuff for villagers to interact with. Also, Eric, my best boy, you got this. Look at you go. Eric is channeling his Clint. Yeah, he has a blacksmith shirt on. <laughs> look at how happy they are. Look at look at my best look at my best villagers. All my villagers are my best villagers, mind you. <laughs> Jacob, I really hope so. I really, really hope so. I'm I'm in so much pain. Look at my face. Yeah, Gaston wasn't on the podium this time, which is unfortunate, but he was in his house for most of it, mind you. Anyways, currently, you guys, back on track here, we're looking for the Petal Tail Dragonfly, which is between 5 p.m. to 7 p.m. August to October. So we don't need to catch it right now. I just like to get it out of the way. Um, and then after 7 p.m., we can catch the House Centipede and then scare a beetle. We're probably going to do some time traveling uh, later on. Uh, Jesse, thank you so very much. Or Giselle? Jesse? I'm not sure. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follow. Let me know how to say your username so that I'm not butchering it. Uh, we need to catch this dragonfly, though, essentially. <laughs> imagine if Gaston won with that tarantula you gave him. Can you imagine him, like, giving away my gift like that? I could, honestly. An all sheep town. Very nice. Oh, Yasmin, I really need it. I've heard a couple people have gotten it recently. So I hope that we find it. What is... Where is that noise coming from? And why are you so loud? Oh, it's you, is it? Being noisy. Bug off, it's over. Time to bug hunt, essentially. <laughs> Does Nat eat the tarantula? Ooh. I think we've... I think I've asked that before. Does Do they? Or does he? Especially the tarantula and the scorpion, right? I can't imagine him eating them, but... Oh, whoops. Eh. Oh no, Dagger, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Asking the real questions here. Yeah, like... I can't imagine him eating them, but... You know, they'd be... Like a really big meal for him, you'd think. I don't know, but I want to see him eat them now. I don't. <laughs> I really don't. Be nasty if he did. Wonder if he says it like selectable and all that stuff. Ew. Gross. <laughs> Wanna have a feature where the girl kangaroos can let their jars out of their pouches and walk them around town? Oh, that would be really, really cute. Rosie, how dare they screw up your poutine? 
How do you, how do you screw up poutine? It was good. Um, I had, uh, what did I have? Mike had a burger for lunch. I had pierogi poutine. Which are two of my favorite foods. So, <laughs> um, that was really interesting. It was really, it was really good, actually. Um, and the fair was great overall. It was a lot of fun. A lot of walking, so Mike and I are both kind of tired today, especially me, because I don't usually walk that much. <laughs> Master bug catcher crystal. <laughs> uh, if only. Ooh, unlurking. I need that as a command. Ooh. I remember I was having trouble finding this one. Oh. Oh, Crystal, you done messed up. Not master bug catcher. <laughs> Playing Cindy Leaf earlier, as I spent the time to pause when I went into my inventory. Oh, yes. Yes, that sounds very familiar. Even worse was uh, when I was getting used to Stardew, because I had played Harvest Moon for so many years, time usually pauses when you go inside, like, uh, your house or shops or stuff like that in the older Harvest Moon games, and it doesn't in Stardew. I can confirm it doesn't. <laughs> uh, are the ice cream machines always broken in McDonald's, or is that a meme? Because where I live, they're never broken. I think... I've honestly heard before that it's not so much that they're broken, it's more so that, like, you know, they just don't feel like, you know, completing your order. <laughs> um, but I guess sometimes they probably do break. I guess you're just really lucky. Also, I'm just kind of catching everything that's not... Excuse you. Excuse... Everything that's not the bug that I need right now. Um, so that I can, uh... Open up, hopefully, space for it to spawn. Spent two in-game Stardew days straight recording my Stardew house, even though my interior is basically just playing. <laughs> Half the time it's broke, the other times I just don't feel it. <laughs> don't be there down for clean since it takes so long to clean. It started early, yeah. I've heard I've heard before that they're kind of obnoxious to clean. Oh no, Jacob, that's not good. Five years I worked for Mackie as I witnessed two breakages, that's it, yeah. Yeah. I really like um soft ice cream, so it's always really disappointing when it's down. smiles hello how are you doing welcome on in i hope you're having a fantastic day today all right so still no you know sightings of this dragonfly but hopefully soon <laughs> mermaid yes <laughs> oops So you guys have told me that this dragonfly is supposed to be massive, and I really should see it, but just in case if you guys think I'm not seeing it, let me know. Freak out at me. I really would like to catch it. Put gravy on the corner so half my fries are soggy and half, half are crispy. But with anything on it, and I can five cheese. Oh, wow. That's disappointing. That is a, you know, a disgrace to poutine. And poutine is amazing. <laughs> Definitely shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> no, I see you, you You put all the pressure on me now. <laughs> but it's okay. What are you guys thinking of doing for dinner tonight? Or what did you guys have for dinner tonight if you've already eaten? Mike and I were thinking of making a meatloaf this weekend. But I'm really hungry right now. I don't think I'm gonna wait for it. <laughs> It's generally huge, you can't miss it. Okay, watch as I miss it. <laughs> Knowing me. Uh, and I've also been- ooh, that's quite a large fish. I've also been told that it's more likely to spawn around water, so, you know, kind of stay around the water, I guess. Oh, have a lumpy hello! I hope you enjoyed your KFC! 
White Castle, very nice. Barbecue chicken sandwich, nice and easy. But now you have Heartbird, oh no. Gonna jump in the river and get it. <laughs> Potato wedges. Uh, Villa's vegetarian meat alternative is very yummy. Ooh, enjoy. Oh, also, I should really be looking out as well. We have 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. Um, another fish that we need. I think it's the gar. I believe. Um, and it's only available in the lake, so. Also be keeping an eye out for that. Having burgers for dinner. My aunt's boyfriend's making some for a uh, birthday. Nice. Um, gonna lurk mode because I'll probably end up napping. No worries, Slatisi, you enjoy your nap. <gasps> oh, Lishi Boba, congratulations! That is amazing. Watch the laundromat. Take away Chinese place next door. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, welcome back. How are you doing today? You're having a good one? Alright, I'm gonna go off and sell everything that I don't need here. I still stand by the whole multiplayer dragonfly theory, even if it's wrong. <laughs> since when's that bench there? Uh, since technically last stream, I just, I, Eevee, or Eevee? My goodness. Yeah, Pokemon Phoebe suggested the bench to me, so I got rid of the yellow bench, and then off stream I put down the white bench and paid it off. Watch your streams for so long on YouTube, I listen to you play while I play, and I make Animal Crossing new and exciting, your voice is so calming. Oh, Sparkly, thank you! Thank you so very much, that means the world to me, honestly. I'm, I'm really glad you guys enjoy it. I've had a little bit of self-doubt recently, uh, in particular when it comes to uploading the full streams. I had some self-doubt whether or not you know, it was really worth it, but I know it, it's more fair for people who can't make it, and I want to make sure everyone has that chance. For two weeks, my emotes are finally accepted. Made all three Pokemon. Oh, well, those are all really cool shiny Pokemon. Those are awesome, Heflumpy. Phoebe's easy. Phoebe is EV confirmed. <laughs> Am I a child for starting to play Pokemon's big game on GameCube again? Honestly, I will never ever ever shun anyone for playing a favorite childhood game or just enjoying a game that's maybe meant for kids. As long as you're not hurting anyone, it's all good. Phoebe. <laughs> Alright, this is not the fish that I need. It's a nice fish, mind you, but it's not the one that I need. Teletubbies for the PS2. Do they really make Teletubbies games for the PS2? Actually, that'd be a good question. If you guys could go back and play one game from your childhood, and I'm not saying you couldn't right now, just like, you know, if, if you really wanted to, what game would you go back and play? On any console, on any system, PC, whatever you want. Or did you not really play games when you were a kid? Because I know some people, you know, maybe have gotten into it at an older age. Animal Jam, Sonic R. Oh, <gasps> Straw Cherry! Straw Cherry, you're speaking to my soul right now. <laughs> yes. Love that game. Uh, I always got stuck on it. Uh, go vacation. Pokemon Diamond. Nice. In the back I am, indeed. Circus Charlie. Um, Crash Bandicoot, the original one. Plock. I- I don't know if I've heard of it. Sims Agents 3. God, I missed that game. <laughs> Webkins? I- you know what? That counts! I- part of me- a huge part of me want, would want to say I want to go back and play Neopets as I remember it. Not this new Neopets that's available now, but the one I know. Ours game on PS2, I forgot the name. Just yes, it's going good! How about you? I hope you're having a good day. Oh yeah, could one of the mods please help out Charisma? 
you guys are available. I had this carnival tycoon game and I forget the name. I'm gonna find it. I have I have a roller coaster tycoon game for DS, but I also have another one that's not the same brand, but Dogs 5. <laughs> Bit of a toss up. Conquer's Bad Fur Day? Oh my goodness, yes. <laughs> Harvest Moon 64? Yes. Oh, Kane, thank you, thank you. Don't they just be able to spawn since it's bug off and people near the river and since it's hidden around to see how fast I can beat it? <laughs> Any Pokemon or Harvest Moon game? Yep. Original Dark Eye games again. But sadly, they won't run on my system even with them being on Steam now. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh, whoops. Oh, Linda back. That's not good. Sorry to hear about that, dude. Skylanders? I've heard of that one before. I don't really know very much about it, but I've definitely heard of it. Yeah, for me, I'd probably say, um, I used to have these PC games. Uh, I think they were done by Playmobil, I believe is the name. Um, and there was three of them. There was the one, um, called Alex's Farm, which is why I always name my male Harvest Moon character Alex. Uh, there was one called Laura, and there was one called Hype. <laughs> or Hike, I believe. And they were three different things entirely. Laura was in the city, Alex was on a farm, and Hyper Hike was like medieval. And they were. Oh, <laughs> I knew the mods were gonna say that. It was a lot of fun. Um, or, I, as I said, I would go back and play the original Neopets, how I remember playing it. Uh, I wanna pronounce it my, my soup, but I don't know if that's the right way to say it. Welcome on in, thank you so much for the follow. Pokemon games I play as a kid, so I'm hopeless I end up buying them all back. Is this a hack? Nope. Nope, I don't really know how to hack um, Animal Crossing. I've seen it being done, but I really couldn't tell you how to do it personally. Come on game, give me the dragonfly, that's all I need. <laughs> I mean, it's not all I need, but it would be nice to finally catch it. Original Nintendo Dogs? Yeah, that's been really fun recently. Somehow managed to not lose my original Pokemon Diamond copy, despite me being a dumb child losing all my games and reset- Yeah, I had a really bad habit of resetting my games frequently as well. Disney Activity Scissors? Oh, I had the Lion King one. Yes. <laughs> To get the newer Smash Bros, but get me on the original one depending on the level and I'm unstoppable? Yeah, I know there's a lot of people who are, you know, they really have that kind of, I wouldn't say bias is the right word, but they're really good at that original one or whichever one they originally played. Uh, Sniper Princess, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in here, thank you so much for coming on over from the YouTube channel. Recently had the urge to replay Soul Silver, but you're loaning it to a friend right now. Isn't that always the way? You just really want to play a game when you don't have access to it. And you know that you don't have access to it. PS2 game about the Disney movie Dinosaur. It was my everything. I had a Land Before Time PC game. Like a CD-ROM game. And I remember there was a maze that you would go through. It was like a point-and-click sort of maze. And there'd be like a T-Rex in there, or like, you know, one of the bigger scary dinosaurs, and it was horrifying. <laughs> oh, you're bringing me back now, you guys. Okay, I'm gonna do a quick save and continue here, see if we can't get this thing to spawn. Oh, Andrew, that was so weird. That was so strange. I don't know if you shared that elsewhere on the Discord, but it was weird. <laughs> Your video since the beginning. The bubbly character is really uplifting. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Well, thank you so much for coming on over. Once again, I- oh, gosh. 
I don't know what to do when people come in and be overly nice to me. Yeah, Blatis, it was a little bit scary for me. I was, I was, ooh, hello, are you what I need? I was a little bit nervous of everything, mind you. Okay, please be the one I need. Uh, no, that's not the one I need. I need a gar. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate. I really thought we had it that time. Why do I always get that fish? I cried one time I played the maze. <laughs> Why am I craving to eat a donut? What's wrong with you? I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Donuts are amazing. Heck, I want a donut right now. Mike and I had mini donuts yesterday. Come on, go away. Don't want those fish. And we have about 30, just under 30 minutes until uh, the dragonfly will no longer spawn. So hopefully we get it. Oh, dagger, we need to trade. <laughs> I really wish we could. That's unfortunate that we can't. But I guess it would make it really easy. Car chomps on my fishing line. Um, let me see here. What else? What other games did I play as a kid? Obviously there was a lot of, like, you know, Harvest Moon games, but a lot of those I actually still have the ability to play. It's a lot of the CD or, like, uh, PC games that I can't play anymore since, for whatever reason, newer computers can't run older titles. Wanna start baking cookies, brownies, and cheesecake again? Ooh, ooh. That sounds really yummy. Great story about that fish. One of my old game plays called Popsy was kind of big and chubby and that fish reminded me of him in Wild World. So that didn't mean Popsy fish. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's so cute. The new Animal Crossing hype is killing me. I cannot wait. Oh my goodness. I, I can't. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Sorry. Give me a second. Sorry. Hi. Hello. Are you what I need? <gasps> you are what I need. <laughs> Awesome, that's the one I've been waiting for. Um, yeah, I- oh gosh, the hype is absolutely unreal. I- like, you know, of course, you know, everyone in here is a testament to the fact that Animal Crossing New Leaf is an older game, but the community is still really active. If we're having streams like this now and, you know, we're getting this much hype, I can't wait to see what happens when New Horizon releases, because it's going to be crazy. I'm going to have so much fun. Okay, give me a second. Give me a second. I need to, uh... <laughs> Emma. <laughs> I need that as an emote. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and donate it and then I'll save. I know I saw someone yelling save at me. <laughs> awesome, so that's uh, another one down. So what I might do, you guys, the Scarab Beetle, the House Centipede, and the Gar are what we have left. And... Oh, Dagger, don't worry. Don't worry. My, uh, my 3DS is plugged in. My 3 is plugged in, it's actively charging. Um, I need to time travel forward, and I think I might time travel to like really late night. Like super late night, but I don't know what time would be the best. Don't assess the fossil, this thing is live. <laughs> Only have eight months until the game is gonna be here. I mean, it's gonna go by fast. 3 a.m., you think? What What's a good, like, middle of the night to you guys to listen to. Oh wait, but we do need to see KK. Dagger is right, so maybe I won't go that late. Okay, we're gonna go to like maybe 11. See, see uh, KK and then we'll we'll go back or we'll go forward a little bit more maybe if we don't find what we need. Also, I'm gonna do another save and continue in here, just to be safe. <laughs> um, okay, so the gar is available late, 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. The scare beetle, 11 p.m. to 8 a.m. And house centipede, 7 p.m. to 8 a.m. So like, 
any time before 8 a.m. essentially. And after 11 would be preferable. So I guess I'll go to 11 first. Ooh, Pepper, enjoy it. Yeah, we need to see KK today. Um, but first... Do I have stuff in my inventory? I do. I'm gonna go off and sell off this stuff. And then we're gonna go see, um, Phoebe, because I think she'll help my face. <laughs> So, I actually don't know where Phoebe is right now. <laughs> I'll be fun guides about everything like dates and times to catch certain fish. It's it's really going to be fun because essentially we're not going to have like, you know, all the guides and stuff right away. We're going to have to have to like, you know, take time and research these things or find them out on our own and then put out guides. So, it's going to be really different. I've been very used to having everything available online for this game. She was by the bridge? Okay. Which bridge? <laughs> I have two. The right one. Okay. I mean, Cube is there. Midge is here. I'm really happy- oh, there she is. Really happy we caught that dragonfly, finally. Whoa, what happened to your face? Who did this to you? Just let me at him. Oh, you got stung by a bee. Aw oh, man, that's too bad. You've been going around shaking trees all willy-nilly, I bet. Now I was chopping them down, but you know I'll take that. If you just had a net, I bet you would've been fine. Here, use this. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, whoops. There we go. My face is feeling better. Thank you, Phoebe. I'm gonna go put away this, uh, white tulip. I like not knowing before New Leaf. I watched a whole playthrough of someone in Japan as they got the game first, and I just spoiled- Yeah, I kinda did the same thing, honestly. I spoiled quite a bit of it for myself. Um, it'll be fun to go in completely blind. There we go. Uh, cool. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and save and, um, set my time forward. Um, and we've been live for a little while here, you guys. I think I want to go on a quick, like, five-ish minute stretch break as well. Um, if you guys would join me in getting up and stretching and grabbing something to eat or drink, it'd be perfect. Uh, if you guys are heading on out, though, thank you so much for watching. If you guys are hanging out, I will be back around 11 p.m. We're gonna go see KK. I'm gonna let you guys choose whatever song you want to listen to that we don't already have. Um, and yeah, give me five minutes, you guys.
Welcome back there, you guys. Sorry about that. I changed the time and then I accidentally went too far forward, so now I have to go back in. I'm so sorry about that delay there. I also smacked my knee on my desk and that really, really hurt. And I can feel it bruising. <laughs> but how are you guys doing? Welcome on in, everyone. And welcome back, those who are still here. Yeah. I Mike has his headphones on and generally he can't hear too well without them or with them on, I think. Maybe he's just gonna ignore me, I'm not sure. And he, even he turned around when he heard the bang, so it was painful. <laughs> Ooh, Pepper, what type of ice cream? I'm pretty sure I like I think you mentioned it the other day, but just in case. <laughs> Though you've never left. <laughs> Um, Alright, so, it's currently 11pm on Saturday night, which means we get to go see KK. Um, I figure we'll do that first, and then we'll... Ooh, you know, do everything else. Uh, ooh, hello, Gaston. You know, random. Uh, tell, tell me more about this. I love you. I love you. I can see what you're doing. You're trying to summon your inner Phoebe and give me more benches, and I appreciate that very much, Gaston. Look at how good he is. Look at this. This is best boy material right here. Choo Choo Caramel. Oh, I don't think I've had that one before. Awesome. Thank you, Gaston. Okay, I'm just gonna go check the lake and see... You know, maybe that Gar would have spawned, but... Unfortunately, our luck isn't that great with this fish, it seems. <laughs> Okay, so, if you guys wouldn't mind, exclamation mark museum in chat. Um, there are songs listed on that document. Those are the ones that I don't already have, as far as I know. I'm pretty sure I don't have all of those. So if you guys could select one that you'd like to hear for tonight. And I'll suggest that one to KK. Okay, so Cherry is saying KK area. Cafe KK. I'm going to select whichever one. Oh, arc. <laughs> arc and Misguided M are the only two. I'm, I'm going to select whichever one I see the most. <laughs> You're saying two days ago? For some reason, I thought we had that one, but... No, I'm seeing Jungar repeatedly. Oh, Razzy Foods. Okay, no worries. Oh, okay. I'm seeing a lot of Jungar. We'll do that one. We'll do that one. Uh, so... Let me just make sure I'm spelling it right here. I think that's correct. There we go. We heard it last week, I'm pretty sure, but we didn't get the music for it because you guys were suggesting it. That's why I don't really like to listen to music too much. <laughs> Random. <laughs> Worried about being able to time travel in New Horizon since I can play mainly at night. I'm hoping that they have more options for people who only are able to play at night. This is a weird song, isn't it? It is. <laughs> Sophie, it's currently almost four o'clock. I'm EST as well. This still sounds like an anime intro to me. And you can't convince me otherwise. <laughs> Yeah, Sparkly, it changes real quick. Um... Sushi? Good, good day? I don't know if I'm saying your full name right, but welcome on in here. Thank you so much for that follow. Also, Sherry, you were not invited to this friend. You're gonna paint my fruits the wrong color. <laughs>
Oh, my brand, 100%. Like, put this song over any anime intro. Almost any. I'm pretty sure it'll fit. <laughs> I wonder if any other game has their credits played as often as Animal Crossing can. Pretty much any, t any Saturday you come and listen to music. The credits get played. <laughs> oh, okay, Emily, I gotta check that out. Sounds adorable. <laughs> Let me just pull it up on my phone real quick for you here. Oh, I still had data on. Blech. Good thing I checked. Oh, that's so cute! <laughs> I love it. There we go, you guys. So, now we got that song to add in. There's not really an endgame, exactly, and that's why they added it in, which works perfectly, mind you. Oh, Sammy, how are you doing today, dude? Oh, come on in. Okay, so music done. We can listen to some more later if you guys really want to. I'm cool with that. Um, but for now, I do want to get going and looking for the house centipede and the gar in town. And Scare Beetle will be on the island. Oh no, Razzy Poo, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry you're not having the best viewing experience at, at the moment. Cool. So, let me hear what this sounds like without KK's overlay here. See, I wouldn't even have thought that that would be the song to go with this one. I didn't even recognize it, you know what I mean? Okay, also, now that we have that one, I'm gonna cross it off of my list here. There we go. And for some reason, you can't emote Twitch plays. <laughs> and also for the scuttle scuttles, this is true. We might run into a uh, tarantula scorpion tonight. We gotta be a bit more careful. You like the 11 p.m. music? Yeah, it's super chill. If you guys want me to turn it up, by the way, let me know. Hopefully, it's still at a decent volume. It's a lot quieter than daytime music. Random catches for Ghastly and my copy of Ultra Moon started today since I finished. Uh. Morality yesterday. Oh, no worries. You enjoy your lurk. Best of luck with your, uh. Your Ghastly encounters. Open the new game. We can get stairwells that aren't. in our doorways. Oop. My phone just went off. Sorry. <laughs> but yeah, guys, we are currently looking for the gar. Um, which so far we've had the absolute probably worst luck with. Uh, as well as the house centipede, which is from rocks. <laughs> and we've had no luck with that yet either. So I'm gonna be doing kind of like a weird loop around town and smacking certain rocks hoping that it pops out and then also going by the lake and then saving and continuing and hoping so that betters my odds here. Oh, I think I would hear it scuttling. How sent to be is a thing of nightmares. Oh boy, are we gonna get spooked? No worries, Sammy. You take your time, you do you. Nothing there. Oh, I was wondering what happened what happened to this flower, and then I realized I probably dug it up last week. You ate all your ice cream pepper? I'm sorry to hear about that. Okay, save and continue. How centipedes, this is work for me in two different towns. Stay at the first rock you find bugs in and save and continue. Oh, and just keep hitting that same rock? Yeah. 
I'll try. I'll definitely give that a try if these first couple rounds don't really work. Uh, MK Brandon, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Uh, Princess Shreve, no, um, I was having kind of a weird off morning today. I couldn't really tell you why. Just wasn't feeling it. Um, I'm feeling pretty good overall now, though. I know, Andrew. We couldn't find that bug anywhere. Now that we've caught it, you know, we see it absolutely everywhere. Oh, Harmonia Cherries, yeah. Um, get out my fishing rod for this section. Also scare away any fish I don't need. Oh gosh darn it. <laughs> Plot we're setting for the last two hours. Gosh, do I ever know that feeling? <laughs> Plot resetting isn't fun at all. It's tedious. When it pays off, it, it is really nice. Okay. Just figured I'd get this out of the way. Ooh, also, we could be hitting this rock as well. Which please let me do emotes. I wonder why it's acting so funny about the emotes today. And like, you're not the first person I've heard say that actually. Like, just today. Ah, don't get in our way, it will kick you up if we must. Just don't hit the rock. Yeah, I'm not even going over and hitting those two rocks over there. I'm just, I don't want to do it by accident. Imagine if there's a rock that- or a bug that you could only get by, um, destroying the fake rock. I would die. <laughs> I can't destroy that rock. No luck there. Also, if you're wondering why I'm not running between, like, where I should be and the next rock and stuff like that, uh, I'd rather not get spooked by a scorpion or, yeah, I guess a tarantula or a scorpion. We'd have to go without a full encyclopedia. Essentially, I'd be like, yeah, we did it minus one. <laughs> I wouldn't even bother. Okay, nothing there. Yeah, okay, what are you guys up to this weekend? Do you guys have any plans? Anything you want to do? I, uh, I don't really have any- other than going to the fair yesterday, that was pretty much the extent of our plans this weekend, so I think I'm going to be spending a lot of time in working on the kind of behind-the-scenes stuff. Scuttle, scuttle. Sleep? Yes. <laughs> it's in update patch notes, so just have this emote. <laughs> going to an art gallery today, that's cool. The weekend after my holiday, then a week off next week, which I'm so glad I got. Yes. At least he's at your mum's, so sleep. Doing as little as possible. Gosh darn it. I hate scaring those things, they're loud. Back in the mindset for school on Wednesday, yes. I know everyone, or I guess I should say a lot of people are going back, so... My last beach time this year, so I'm gonna really enjoy my family's company before college starts again. Swim, eat ice cream, draw with the little ones. Sounds good. Wishing the shower would work. Uh, Kev Bowie, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. You still have until September? Yeah, I know schools here go back in uh, early September as well. Making my laundry, live at my in-laws, and more cleaning tomorrow with some commissions. I try to convince my husband to play Pokemon Go when he comes back from his camping trip. I hope you're successful. 
Friends are having a nice price. This one of them just turned 21 this week. Awesome. I hope they have fun and are responsible and safe, of course. I just fired my school. It's the first football game of the season. I don't care about football, but I'm in the marching band. Oh, have fun. Have fun. Good luck there. Work placement is still fixing the roof, so I'm chilling. <laughs> Three two week holidays, all spaced out, but we're at school while you guys weren't. And it was a pain, yeah. <laughs> Man, like, I haven't even seen a centipede, let alone the house centipede yet. Part of me thinks I shouldn't even bother with that rock, because... That one's a little bit obnoxious. I please leave, people are so annoying. Oh no. I don't think this is the fish we need, but... Oh, pumpkin days! Thank you so very much for the raid! Welcome back! Well, come on in, can we get a shout out for pumpkin days? One of the mods, please and thank you. What were you guys up to? What were you guys up to? Welcome on in here. Welcome back. Oh, Rosy P, best of luck finding a way to play that game because it's so much fun. <laughs> uh, Kai, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. How are you guys all doing today? We're just playing some New Leaf. I'm trying to catch uh, a bug and a fish that we need for our encyclopedia and it's honestly been kind of going slow. So hopefully you guys coming in gives me a little bit of luck. And you were, of course, playing Pumpkin Days. Very nice. Very nice. Awesome. Well, welcome on in, you guys. My name is Crystal. Um, I'm a full-time streamer. Stream every day at 2 p.m. EST and play a lot of Animal Crossing. <laughs> However, Pumpkin Days is a game I've been kind of keeping my eye on. Checking out every now and then. Yeah, Chris Mother, essentially just like opposite colors of each other, right? Yeah, yeah, Rosipu. Ooh, Gaston, what's up, buddy? You know, you got something I want, right? Oh, yeah, you can have that. Is it normal holding backspace to delete text switch? Oh, cause it to lag like crazy. Um, I've never had that, but I, I honestly don't type in chat that often, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of just lurk in streams. Oh, Maybe also heard about new game Animal Crossing New Horizons next year? Yes, yes, there's a lot of hype in the community for that game, and I'm really, really looking forward to trying it out. Watch Monkey, enjoy the birthday party. We'll see you later. Oh, uh, Pumpkin Days is going good. Um, we caught a bug earlier that I had been missing. Um, if you guys are new, we're trying to like 100% complete the museum in this save file, which is not something I've ever done before. And uh, it's been going kind of slow, but we're trying. <laughs> we're ne now looking for a type of fish and a house centipede, which only comes out of rocks. So it's why you're seeing me walk around smacking rocks, essentially. <laughs> And saving, continuing to try and, like, reset the town. Oh, Katie, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in. I don't know if that picked up on my microphone, but, like, someone upstairs just dropped something super heavy. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully, Pumpkin Days, hopefully. It'd be nice if we could even get, like, one to spawn. But, uh, so far the game doesn't like us that much. I only found the regal wall from upstairs in my main town and it was a waste of money and time. Fine, because it didn't look right. Oh no. Oh gosh, I'm trying to remember. Does anyone remember? Ark, I think you would know. There's a website where you can essentially find the entire catalog of Animal Crossing. 
and you can look up items and furniture sets and you can see what they look like. Um, does anyone know the website I'm talking about? Yeah, MoriDB, yeah. Um, Ark, do you want to link that just in case people, like... Miranda, I don't know if you know that website, but it's super handy if you want to, like, try and put together a room. That's what I would recommend. Come on, you cherries. Enjoy your breakfast. We'll see you later. And I wish I was eating right now. <laughs> I would go for some food. Very handy website, yes. If you're really intent on interior decorating and stuff like that, very, very handy. Nabok, what you do? Never seen it before? Yeah, I- Oh, 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 oh. Hi. Hello. You're horrifying. Is that it? Ew. Ew, that's so gross. I caught it, though. <laughs> yes. Congratulations to my encyclopedia. You finally get what you want. Um, alright, awesome. How centipede? Crossing off the list. <laughs> I'm gonna go donate it right now. That's gross. I don't want this in my pockets no more. <laughs> it has too many legs. Imagine finding that in your house. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. But Pumpkin Days, I think your raid was just the luck I needed because we've been trying for a little while and we weren't finding it. Thank you so very much. It scares me because it's called a house centipede. Yeah, so it's like one that you find in houses. Ew. <laughs> Uh, okay. There we go, getting rid of that, because we don't need that. <laughs> oh, Lindabog, very nice. I know you were choosing between two a little while ago. Apartment is full of these because we live in a half basement. I cry every time I see them. Oh, I, I would... Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. Pretty much. Oh, Padfoot, that's awesome. That's so close. Okay, I'm gonna do another save and continue, just in case by some weird, wacky coincidence my game shuts off or something like that. I don't trust anything. So all we need now, you guys, is that gar, which is that fish in the lake, and the scarab beetle, which is on the island. And that one, I think, is gonna take us a little while. Save and continue, and suddenly Blazers is sleeping. <laughs> Uh, don't need my net out. Don't want to get attacked by, uh, Tarantula or Scorpion. Scarant <laughs> Scarantula? Did I read that right? Just casually your game shuts down. I don't trust anything. I really don't. This is why in, like, Pokemon, for example, I'll save, like, five times in a row. If I can. I generally try not to on stream because I know it's probably really boring to watch, but like... Do you have fleas? Blue bear. Where's my... There we go. Gosh darn it, blue bear. Catch and donate birds. Poor Midge. <laughs> Poor Phoebe. Strawberry milk, we'll see you later. Blathers is you, Emma. I think I saved the previous two times. Let me save again. It's more like I wasn't watching. I need to make sure I'm actually saving. You can catch and donate a frog. Poor Lily. Yeah, actually, now that you mention it. Okay, so... I'm just gonna do a couple saving continues and just kind of circle around the lake, see if we can't spot this thing. And then if not, then I'll just head on over to the island and I'll leave the fish for another time. We caught two bugs tonight, so that is huge progress. We literally only have five bugs left. Um, and a lot of the fish that we need can be caught in like September, so. Anything up there? Five pugs? Bugs. <laughs> I wish it was five pugs. Pugs are... Pugs are darn cute. Ah, uh, Rossi I don't think I'm gonna do a stream later. Um, 
But I hope you have a fantastic day if you're heading out. Oak silk moss. Or silk oak moss are so rare. Those are like the really large ones, right? Also, I'm sorry if the saving and continuing is kind of boring to watch. Thankfully, this game doesn't take like a super long time to save. Like, for example, Pokemon Platinum. I'm looking at you. Also, apparently this will only um, spawn in the uh, in the lake right here, so we have to get kind of lucky to spot it. Hey, Myth, how's it going? Welcome back. How are you doing today? Simply save and continue. <laughs> Diamond are bad as well? Yeah, I imagine they'd all be about the same, right? Okay, if we don't get this time, I'll go on to the island and then when we come back, you know, fingers crossed, maybe we'll find it. <laughs> It'd be really, really lucky if we could get all of them today. <laughs> Melancholy melodies, yes. I'm calling it out primarily because I'm playing it on stream <laughs> on Mondays and that saving is just ridiculous. No, we didn't, Andrew. That's the thing we need on the on the island. Sounds good, Rosie Poo. See you later. Have a fantastic time and enjoy your dinner. I'm, I'm getting kind of hungry myself, mind you. One more time. I know I said that was the last time, but one more time. Catch it off guard. <laughs> Come on, game. Come on, just spawn a big fish that I actually need this time instead of the one I don't. luck but that's okay that's okay that's supposedly pretty rare and it's funny because we've had really good luck getting all the other types of fish from the lake but not that one all right we get our cap we got we got kk song earlier we get a captain song now it's a good time Oh my goodness, Pokemon Girl, so many hours. Okay, game captain, do it when? <laughs> I don't think I've ever spent that much time in a Pokemon game before. I think I average around 60 to 100 hours, give or take. And why? Yeah, I think my copy of Sun might have over a hundred because I actually tried to complete the- or actually I did complete the Pokedex on that one. Or ass, yeah, actually. I also did some Masuda Method shiny hunting in that, so that one might have a lot as well. Fallout 4. Oh my goodness, over 2,000 hours, nearly 3,000. Jeez. My highest game, my longest played game, I think, is Stardew on Steam, which is over 500 hours now. And I'm pretty proud of that. <laughs> Love going to the island, it's so relaxing. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I enjoy it. 600. Oh my goodness. <laughs> World of Warcraft, yes. That can be very addicting. Just 
just wants the story and be done, yeah. That's how I used to play. Recently I've been kind of really enjoying, like, you know, getting the shiny charms and stuff like that, so... Okay. So I'm gonna grab my net, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna circle around the island and catch the beetles off the palm trees and keep an eye on these regular fruit trees we have in the center, because that's where the scarab beetle is gonna spawn. Um... And hopefully we see it in the time we go around. <laughs> Oh, Sophie? Yeah. So much fun. Um, so you're not it. I'll probably release anything I don't need later. Sorry, playtime has gone up by 100 hours in like the past two weeks. Yeah, Stardew- oops. Stardew's a little bit- a little bit, um... What's the word? Uh, addicting. Just- just a tiny bit. Ooh, that's a shark down there, but I don't have my fishing rod on me. 800 hours for Mass Effect 3, lots and lots of redoing the game all over again. Still romancing the same character. <laughs> Is it a baby shark? Oh my goodness, random. That reminds me. Um, when Mike and I were heading to the fair yesterday, we were walking through a neighborhood uh, to... None of those are what I need. Um, to get... Um, to a bus stop to go down to the fair and we passed by this one fenced in backyard and all we heard was baby shark but it was in a different language and I think it was like a, a kid's like a toddler's birthday party going on oh gosh <laughs> and then both of us had it in our heads for probably the rest of the morning oh gosh I moved too fast I always scare those ones away Almost got the very first. I'm completely the Poke. Our national decks in Omega Ruby. Only three missing legendary Pokemon. Oh my goodness, that's so close. Um, Alright, none of those are what I need. The blue one you just scared away on the fruit tree is worth a lot. Ooh, okay, good to know. I will catch that next time if I see it. <laughs> there we go. Such an odd song to get so big. I know, I know. I'm sure there's lots of other like little kid or baby songs that are like super catchy but super annoying. Just haven't been picked up yet by anyone. <laughs> Watch my fruit trees growing. I'll finally get the greenhouse in Stardew. Yes. Always, uh, always a good thing. Okay, so that middle one, Duddles, you were saying, I think is worth a lot. Yeah, the giant stag. Nope, go away. There we go. The make story for 3DS? Unfortunately not. Unfortunately not. It's available on Android, iOS, you know, phones, PC, you know, Mac, computers in general, um, Xbox One, PS4, Switch. Not 3DS though. Thank you, Pikmin Lover. You as well. Have a fantastic day at work. Oh, well, hello. Is that what I need? Is that is that just me being crazy? Is that not kind of golden looking? I'm gonna walk so slowly towards you. Hype, yes? Okay, people are freaking out, so don't don't freak out, Crystal. We got this. Stardew on Vita? Yeah, I have it there too. Is this it? We caught it! Yes! <laughs> awesome! So that is- we only need one thing left, and that's that silly fish back on the mainland. Awesome. And we only have four bugs left. Four bugs, if you would believe it. Until we finish the collection. Cool. So, hmm. What would you guys like to see? Do you guys think I should fill up my pockets here? Or fill up my storage? Um, with rare beetles and like bring them back? 
Or should I go home and continue trying to find the gar? Fill up my pockets? I can do both, mind you. It's just... Get them bills. <laughs> oh no, Adam. <laughs> Coins? Yeah, we gotta get all these all these Animal Crossing coins. I think this one wasn't one that I wanted. Monies. Okay, we're gonna get them monies. Um, but that was a lot faster than I thought it would be. I think we're just having a really good luck day today, you guys. Um, and then when we catch the fish, we're only gonna have Six left. We currently have seven left with the fish outstanding. Um, and that's a little bit crazy. Dark mode on YouTube on PC and I'm so happy- oh my goodness. Any website that allows me to have dark mode, I have it. <laughs> oh, Ark, have we been doing it wrong this entire time? Yeah, who knows? Maybe, maybe we'll get like, oh god, go away. Maybe we'll get super, super lucky when we go back to, you know, town, and you know we'll be going up to Reese's, and then we'll see a really big, um, shadow in in the uh, in the lake, and then we'll catch the fish we need, and then we're 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 good to go essentially. Amos is doing it wrong. <laughs> You only have dark mode on here? Yeah, dark mode on Twitch is fantastic. And for whatever reason, I still haven't figured out why. I've mentioned it a while ago. Twitch, for some reason, after I end a stream, if I go over to a new page on Twitch, say for example, I host someone and I go check out their stream. Um, oh, I, I know, Katie. I know. I'm going to sell it tomorrow. Or next time I play. Um, it goes over to light mode, and I don't know why it does that. It's only after I finish streaming. <laughs> It's random. I started my phone a little while ago, but it was just more to support the game. Fishing is hecky impossible on there. Yeah, I um, I'm kind of in the same boat. You know, I have it on PS4 as well. I don't usually play it on there, mind you, but it's nice to support the game. I really appreciate it, and I have a hard copy of Stardew now, which is really really cool. Get rid of, get rid of, nothing there. Come on, go away. You have? Yeah, Mike got it for me a while ago. We were in a... Ooh, gosh darn it. Uh, we were in a Toys R Us, I think it was, and we saw Stardew, or a Walmart. And we saw Stardew physically for PS4, and we were like, um, yes. <laughs> so he got it for me. Well, How was the story told wrong? Got it. Then we didn't get it. Uh huh. And then I saw it like a week or so later. At, oh, and then uh, you got it. Shoppers Drug. Oh, is it a Shoppers Drug Mart? Really? Yes. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, that's how. I just knew Mike bought it for me. I don't remember the details. This is too much for my poor brain to handle. <laughs> I could, Andrew, I could, but at the moment I'm enjoying catching the giant stags. Also, I'm a little bit leery to like, or leery, wary, to cut them down just because I've needed them in the past. I don't think any of the other bugs, ladybugs, bell cricket, cricket, and red dragonfly, they don't need the trees, but... I'm back. I think you mean Mike, not Mark. I did know a Mark. That's definitely not Mark, though. <laughs> Mike just casually calling me out. It's it's sad when Mike has a better memory than I do for that kind of stuff, but he did buy it, so... All I know is that he gave it to me and I'm like, this is cool. <laughs> Random, I feel sorry for easily tap again then, let me tell you that much. <laughs> 
Oh, whoops. Instar, hello, how are you doing? My day's going pretty well. Um, was having kind of an off morning this morning, but I'm feeling really good after, you know, so far a couple hours of streaming. Wish where I lived still had a Toys R Us and move a car since it's become impossible. You know what though? We still do have Toys R Us here, but um, they've pretty much stopped selling Amiibo cards completely, actually, anywhere I go physically, which really sucks. But my sister started for her Switch to surprise her when she got back from the store that she asked me about a lot. And she didn't mind details was ever so pressuring. Oh no. Oh, Linda back. No worries, no worries. So I think with this round of bugs that we're gonna sell, we're gonna be up to quite a decent size of- ooh, ooh. Cathario, thank you so much for that tier 2 7 month reset. Thank you, thank you. I hope you continue to enjoy hanging out with us. Enjoy the emotes. Thank you so much. And how are you doing today? Welcome back in here. I feel like, also, I just realized, I'm sorry you guys, I just suddenly tweaked this. I feel like all of our previous Saturday streams of August, pretty much, have been me hunting for things, time traveling, and going to the island. <laughs> I just realized, I'm so sorry. Oh, Raven Star, thank you. Also, I forgot to show you guys. Um, I'll either take a picture for you guys or post it on the Discord or show you guys on stream later. But, um,. I've been wearing a Fitbit watch for a little while and I got a new wrist thing, like a wrist uh, strap for it. And uh, it's like a rainbow metal thing and it's so pretty. And I, I matched my rainbow outfit in Animal Crossing. Uh, big fat eagle. Thank you very much for the follow. It's rainbow pepper. I love it. Moving to Canada. <laughs> We do usually talk about food while bug hunting, you're absolutely right. We're missing six cards, and they're so expensive and hard to find. Bob, Fauna, Blue Bear, Jambet, KK, and Cookie. A lot of those are really popular villagers as well, so they're definitely going to be expensive. Oh man, I'm having such bad luck. I don't feel like I'm walking that fast. When do we not talk about food though? This is true. This is true. I mean, I did ask what people were having for dinner or had for dinner earlier. That counts, right? Which I still haven't decided what we're having tonight because I don't think meatloaf is happening tonight because I'm super hungry. I have a favorite color? Mine is purple and black. Um, so I have a theme kind of around my room. My Switch and my 3DS or my 2DS XL uh, are both blue and black. I really like those colors together, like a light blue and, a, and black. Um, but overall, I really like blue. Not blue and yellow? Not blue and yellow, Ark. I'm sorry. Just bear. Snow cones or ice cream? I'd say uh, ice cream. I don't know why I was about to say snow cones. Oh, Andrew, that sounds amazing. Raven Star, but uh, purple is definitely close second. I, I am quite fond of purple. Which actually, fun story, you guys. I didn't used to like purple when I was younger. And then I went to an EB Games one day with the intention to get myself a 3DS, like an original 3DS, brand new. And this is before the 3DS XL, this is before the 2DS is like the 3DS was new. <laughs> and the only color they had available was purple. And I'm like, I really want this today, so I'm gonna get it. And I wasn't that impressed with it at first, and then it kind of just grew on me. Oh, Melancholy Melodies, I will be there. <laughs> I will have some of that. Mm -hmm. 
favorite color is like dark red, yeah. But yeah, I really, really like that purple 3DS. I still have it. It's actually the one that I had my initial capture card installed in if you guys have been here for a while. I sent it all the way to Japan. It's been farther than I have. I <laughs> uh, had it modified and then it was, oops, it was sent back. Um, and I remember I was being really careful carrying it around when I first got it. And then my old cat, Kitty, she was like weaving between my legs. She was really happy to see me come out of my room. And I tripped because I wasn't expecting her there. And I dropped the 3DS and it worked perfectly. It still works this day, but um, it had like a crack on the outer lid and it really bothered me. But it was like, you couldn't feel the crack, if you know what I mean. But you could see it in the, uh, in the corner there. Yeah, Kitty Kitty had some choice words spoken to her that day. <laughs> Two original purple 3S and the Pokemon 20th anniversary new Nintendo 3DS. Those that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Scary to drop stuff. Yeah, thankfully I've I've had very good luck when I've dropped electronics. I've I had one screen break, um, and thankfully I had Mike's old phone, which was identical to the one I dropped, to replace it with. I just had to transfer over my cards and stuff. Uh, Luz... Lu I'm not gonna pronounce it, sorry. Luz... Mitch? I don't know if I'm saying it right. Thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> um, but... Like, in terms of 3DSs and stuff, I've never really broken anything too badly. Everything still worked. Whether or not the screen was still attached is another question. Moshi monster stickers from years ago on it that I refused to take off. Oh, see you later, Zach. A Galaxy Purple Switch. I really wish the Switch would have a couple more theme options, as well as, like, options for... You know the actual console itself. Um, I want to pronounce it Couplet? Am I saying your name right? Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Uh, Andrew, one of my 3D- or my original DS, I should say, the screen isn't fully attached to the base. Um, but it still works. <laughs> it still works. A little bit crazy looking though. Lose, lose Mick. Okay, awesome. Welcome on in. How are you doing today? Oh gosh, I'm doing so poorly. Uh, Shroomy Snake, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. How are you doing today as well? You guys are just joining us. We're doing some bug hunting on the island, earning some bells. Um, I was also getting bugs I need for and fish, I guess, from my encyclopedia, so kind of what we're doing today. Oh, Strawberry, yes, I've seen customized switches. They look so good, but I wouldn't, like, you know, have the guts to take it apart and, and fix and change things. Ah, oh, Sushi, yes! We were, we were, like, five away earlier, so that's absolutely crazy. Thank you guys very much. We're gonna have a lot to celebrate soon for both the YouTube channel and the Twitch channel. Broke it on its right side, it fell when I tried to put it back in my pockets. Oh no. Over 9,000. <laughs> Hi Logan, how are you doing today? Okay, go super slow because I keep scaring bugs away on this tree. Nothing there. Well, you know what, I'll put away what I have for now. And then hopefully when I come back out, the bugs will be a bit nicer to me. It's kind of like your hobby. I mean, it's awesome that you're comfortable doing it as well. It's a good skill to have. Sammy, I don't know if you meant to type in Coke, but <laughs> it worked, it works.
Hey Caroline, how are you doing? Welcome back. What have you been up to today? <laughs> Sammy. But yeah, um, Twitch channel and YouTube channel are growing very quickly. We need 303 subscribers on YouTube to reach 50. Yeah, 50k is coming up real quick and I still don't know exactly what we're doing for it. I uh, need to write something down and post a video for uh, suggestions. Uh, busy Freds, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Hey, look at Animal Crossing. Yeah. Super chill. Only last one three days and it was my dog. So I had to use it as a chew toy. Oh my god. <laughs> Is your Was your dog okay? My goodness. Sophie, enjoy your lurk. Of course, I'm starting for about a week or two, and yet I still forget I have it. Oh my goodness, Adam. I have people telling me in chat and like reminding me that I have a horse when I play Stardew. <laughs> oh no. I was going too fast on that one. Where are things I don't need? I want a pretty color for my Switch. I like the black one. But I think I need more colors. I got the black and gray one um, to start off and then ended up getting different color Joy-Cons to make it look a little bit more fancy. Take your horse everywhere on Stardew. I feel so bad for it. Yeah, my horse gets to be lazy. Uh, okay, Raven, that's good. Well, I understand why you'd be upset with that, but I'm happy she was okay. for New Horizon Joy-Cons? Yeah. I wonder what they'll look like. Like, there's that white background with like the different colored Animal Crossing designs on it, if you guys know the one I'm talking about, um, that kind of screams New Leaf to me. I'm wondering what the design will be for New Horizons. Uh, bring the Pokedex! I like that username. Thank you so much for the follow! Welcome on in! How are you doing today? Uh, busy, yes. Animal Crossing and Stardew are kind of our main things here. Um, if you guys are just joining us, if you're new, maybe I do stream every day, but I stream Animal Crossing on Tuesdays, Thursdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Um, and Stardew is kind of our dedicated Friday stream thing, but we occasionally stream it outside of Friday as well. Rainy, you always park it under a tree. That's cute. That's cute. You give you that pale green color, same as the special Animal Crossing 2DS XL. And one light blue. Maybe I could see I could see light blue and green for sure. Oh no, Andrew. Best of luck. Make use of the uh, of the lures, I think they're called. This just has Bob's face on it. <laughs> Stardew Joy-Cons. That would be cool as well. Okay, for Animal Crossing on the Switch? Very much so. I, like, I don't really think there's proper words about how hyped I am. I'm just really looking forward to seeing the community really kind of expand and grow during that time. Because, like, obviously right now New Leaf is a super old game, but um, there's still a fairly active community on here, so it'll be fun when we get a whole lot of new people joining in or people coming back to the series. Pink and blue Joy-Cons for recent sires would be cute, but we don't even know if they're going to be in the game yet. It's true, I can't imagine that they'll be gone, but... At the Zelda for new 3DS XL, original 3DS for hacks, as well as an original DS and DSi and DSi XL. That's something I never got was a DSi. I don't, I don't know what I was doing at that time, but I just kind of completely forgot that was a thing. Need more stuff on Horizons. I hope that we get like a direct or something. Um, maybe September-ish. Telling us more about it, but I'm not really gonna hold my breath on that one. They kind of have Pokemon and 
Luigi's Mansion coming out first that they're gonna want to focus on. I'll be able to finish school because he'll be playing Animal Crossing on Switch. Honestly, yeah. I feel that. And the fact that Animal Crossing is like, you know, you can play it for the entire day because it goes by hourly. You know, it's hard to put down. <laughs> Maybe one in December? Yeah, December would work. Um, even after the holiday season, though, because I know they're going to be hyping up those two games. Oh! I wasn't close enough, I guess. Oh, we're going to start, yep. Oh, I feel that. You need a demo by January? I wonder if they'll even do a demo. I wonder what kind of demo you could do. Want to go with almost no knowledge? Yeah. Almost 2020 hits my hate will build like crazy? Yes. If it was pushed back though, yeah, everyone would riot. I think there would be a lot of disappointment, just like there was, like, you know, we've we were counting on 2019 and then we didn't get any news for so long. Um, and then suddenly they're like, yeah, March 2020. Um, I think there would be a lot of upset, but at the same time, you know, whatever needs to happen for, uh, for the game to be as good as possible. Uh, the random O'Hare, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. More addicting than Animal Crossing though, because it's Animal Crossing. There's a limit to how much you can productively do. No, exactly. Um, that's the one downfall, I guess, of Animal Crossing is there's only so much you can do in a day, because it's meant to be like a slow pace, just you know, do what you can in a day sort of thing. Whereas Animal or Stardew, you don't have that time limit. It's not by a real live clock, and you can just play and play and play, <laughs> and get more and more stuff done. Yeah, something very serious would have to happen for them to de uh, delete. My goodness, delay. <laughs> but no, I'm really looking forward to it. And speaking of you guys, is there any other games coming out other than Animal Crossing that you guys are super hyped for? Because we do have a while to wait before Animal Crossing comes out, so we may as well focus on the other stuff. I have quite a few coming out that I'm just ready for. Yeah, Harvest Moon is very similar, Logan, yeah. Sit back for a version two, and I'm so glad they did, as it's one of my favorites, and I'm glad they didn't push it. Um, yeah, exactly. Just take their time. Final Fantasy VII, of course. Sword and Shield. Outer Worlds, yes, that one does look fun. Luigi's Mansion. Link's Awakening, yeah. Hype for the Strums, yeah. I'm looking forward to Sword and Shield, Luigi's Mansion, Final Fantasy VII Remake, of course. Uh, there's two new Story of Season games coming out, which if you guys, um, don't know, they're essentially like Harvest Moon games. Um, there's, uh, Yokai Watch that I want to get more into. Um, Astral Chain, Gazaro, yeah, Mike is looking forward to that one. Nova, hello, how are you doing? Welcome on in here. Um, I'm not currently playing with people, but you're more than welcome to chill out with us and chat if you'd like. Oh, a cane. Very nice. Very nice. Oh, Breath of the Wild 2, even though we have no idea when that's done. Yes. <laughs> Rune Factory 5 when it comes out. You know what? There is a Rune Factory coming out for Switch, isn't it? I might have to look into that. Ooh, there's another one of the bug I just needed to catch. Yeah, Adam, I didn't really enjoy it all that much when I first played it either, but these days Luigi's Mansion is definitely one of my favorite GameCube games. You chose it. I'll might try to find Pokemon Black and White. Yeah, that's cool as well. Honestly, if there's games that are already out that you're interested in playing and you're just kind of waiting on getting them. That's cool as well. You're definitely more than welcome to let me know about those. Four is being re-released on Switch. Okay, okay.
Okay, um... I think we're nearly done all the collecting we need. <laughs> Sparkly true. True true. Oh, welcome back, Ravenstar. Welcome back. Let's see how many more we need here. Okay, I need ten more and then we're good to go. the game generally works like that though once you've caught the bug it becomes more common i mean for some reason it feels like that for sure um i wish i don't think anyone's actually opened up animal crossing and taken a look at like the actual code of it and if they have i haven't seen it online <laughs> oh sophie that's awesome i hope you enjoy it breath of the wild is very very fun i'm not very good at its combat mind you but I enjoyed it quite a lot. Oh, Adam, congratulations again, that skull key. You guys talking about Stardew is just honestly making me want to play Stardew. <laughs> Not gonna lie. Um, I was playing a little bit of my private Switch farm this morning and that was a lot of fun. Um, and I have a really nice layout now on the wilderness map and I'm really looking forward to like actually putting it into uh, effect. I just need to obviously get the materials to do it. <laughs> but I'm literally like only in like the 20th day of spring, so. I've even sorry. Is there a different Zelda game that you're more of a fan of? Oh, Andrew. <laughs> Arm, honestly, it's so. It's, it's almost that same level of like almost somewhat mindless just going around in circles. But Arm, how are you doing today, dude? Welcome back. Ooh, Pepper, very nice. I have plans, actually, for after stream to go on Amazon and, like, low-key just look up pajama pants for Mike and I. Because <laughs> we, we essentially live in pajama pants when we're home. So I figure having some extra pairs, especially for, like, winter and stuff, would be really nice. In game year started since I got the skull key. Still haven't been in the skull mines or the skull cavern. Make sure they have pockets, very important, yes. Pockets and a drawstring, also very important. Oh, Ark, I wish, I wish. Skyward Sword, Twilight Princess, and Wind Waker. Oh, I love Wind Waker as well. I like what I've played of Twilight Princess, and I haven't touched Skyward Sword yet, but I do own it. Real drawstring, not one of those fake ones. I don't understand why pants have fake drawstrings. Or fake pockets, for that matter. It bothers me. Live in sweatpants at home? Love the cheap $5 ones at Walmart? Yes, yes. Honestly, that was like my second place to look if I couldn't find any that Mike and I like on Amazon. is just to go out, pick up some Taco Bell, grab some sweatpants, come home. <laughs> Indianapolis, Wednesday for Indie Furcon. Gonna be a nice well-deserved vacay. Awesome, you enjoy it. Terrified of the Skull Cavern? I'm always killed the second I enter them? Yeah, it takes a little while, but honestly, if I can do it, you guys are gonna fly through it. <laughs> uh, is it the real Dr. Cortex? Welcome on in, how are you doing today? Oh, Sparkly, yes. <laughs> Uh, so we have five so far. We need another five and then, gosh darn it, we can go home. <laughs> and Nashi, welcome on in. How are you doing? Wish the remaster Wind Waker HD. Wasn't HD, I mean it looks pretty, but it hurts your eyes. Really? I really loved how it looked. So I found some junk food. My kind of thing. Yeah, I feel like Mike and I kind of might just have that kind of weekend. I wish we had a Walmart closer to us, though. We have to travel quite far to go to one. Ooh, that's a gold one. Yeah, Andrew, honestly, the Skull Caverns are a lot, lot, lot easier if you happen to have that Prismatic Shard and get that Galaxy Sword. 
Oh, Andrew, was it? Gosh darn it. <laughs> oh well. Oh, Miss Goddamn, yes. Good tips. And honestly, like, it doesn't matter. They're sweatpants. They're not meant to be form-fitting. It's all good. Actually, you know what, Star Cherry? I thought random was the bot as well for a second there. You can use the wallpaper bug. Yes. Does, actually, does that still work in the current update of the game? I think we've talked about this before, but... Actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, Raven Star, I think there might actually be a Walmart closer to me and Mike, but like, it's a weird, sketchy one that I haven't been to before. Or, sorry, I've been to once. <laughs> um, haven't been to in a long time, mind you, but I don't know how to explain this, but the floors were weird. The floors were all like hardwood, but it was spongy. I don't know how to explain this properly. It was strange stepping on it. It just made me, the entire experience was uncomfortable. <laughs> It isn't patched yet? Really? Huh. I may need to do that privately. <laughs> Alright, we're at six. Galaxy theme, Albert Einstein pajama pants, that's cool. Yeah, men's quality- like- Going shopping for clothes with Mike is ridiculous. He can get like a bag, like a literal bag from Walmart of like plain black t-shirts that fit him really well for like next to nothing. And for women, it's all sold individually at much higher prices. <laughs> Got surprised at McDonald's, but the fries are cold. Love their fries, but I am happy. <laughs> I'm glad you're, you're happy with your McDonald's. If we try to get men's t-shirts to make us look boxy, yep. Yep. Going shopping with Mike has been very eye-opening. <laughs> very easy to get everything for him. There we go. Once we have never makes me feel comfortable. I feel like the male salespeople are always leering at me. Like following me around the store. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, random. I know I know some people, some women, who will just put on men's deodorant or antiperspirant. Like, if you don't mind the smell. Mike is not currently on his way to work, don't worry. I don't update my bot, I'm a terrible person. I need to have it, like, on a schedule or something so that it auto-updates itself when he should be at work. <laughs> oh, Jacob, does she? Try to find things for my husband. He's six. Oh my goodness. Yeah, he's tall. And you're five. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm thankfully not so short that it's hard to find things for me. I just find like shirts and stuff. I, I'm, I'm just built funny. I feel like. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think if I counted that correctly, one more. because they're clothes, yeah. No, it's not fun. <laughs> you think men's deodorant smells better? Yeah. I recently, a little while ago, got some shaving cream for my body. Um, I can't wax. Oh, was this the expensive one? Because uh, my skin gets really irritated by it. Um, and I saw that men's was cheaper and Mike is like, just go get that one. And I smelt like an amazing guy. <laughs> I'll put it that way. It was beautiful. It was blue. I really liked it. You're a sucker for sweet and flowery smells, yeah. Yep, Miss Goddamn, same here now. I've learned that recently. <laughs> I, uh, 
I don't actually see myself going back either. <laughs> I really like the smell of that stuff. Too much trouble to find something that fits properly? Yeah, I, I get really anxious like uh, going into changing rooms as well, which doesn't help. Link's deodorant. I know a lot of the boys in my school use Axe and stuff like that. Wait to see closer girls because I'm average. Exactly, there you go. If it's blue, it's a good deodorant. <laughs> Links is axe. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. I hate when they ask you over and over if you need help. I know. I'm so awkward. I'm just like, no, thank you. <laughs> Please leave me alone. <laughs> I'm small and shy and socially awkward. It's her perfume that she left over here to make some of the rooms smell better. I don't use it on me, but like most women's closest times or like why is it just exist? I know I know introverts unite <laughs> maybe I want to smell like a dad fight me exactly and if it oh actually I shouldn't be taking everything in here out yet but I'll take out what I need to donate Let me just check on this river here, or on this lake. It'd be really nice if this fish would spawn, but... When I did pee, the change names are just a giant whiff of like every deodorant ever and it was not pretty. I'd rather it smell like a horrible, horrible deodorant shop than body odor, <laughs> personally. Lesser of two evils. Oh no, random. <laughs> but they're good chemicals, gosh darn it. Yeah, I, I really appreciate it. <laughs> Went straight in my eye. Oh no. <laughs> Gonna change after swimming in school? Yeah, that was always fun. And fun is like very sarcastically used there. <laughs> Oh, Brandon, you broke a butt. Oh, gosh. I've been there. I've been there. <laughs> okay, Scarab Beetle in. Or not, it continues to be a river. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, Jacob, we didn't even have the option of private changing stalls. It was all an open area. It was fantastic. Again, very sarcastically used. Wow, there's Hedge having a nightmare today. He's getting all the bugs. He really is, too. Rest in peace, George, the tarantula. We didn't know him very long. We saw him on screen for about a second. But, uh, you know, he lived a good life. Um, I don't think he had any family, so he didn't really leave anyone behind. But George was a good guy. All right, we like George. He didn't come after me. Sleep well, G George? George, is that you? Oh my goodness, George? George, I'm getting you out, buddy. Don't you worry about it. Come on, hook on to this, buddy. You got the- oh, Andrew, no! <laughs> jo oh, you're not George. Oh, that's awkward. Gosh darn it, George. He became a fish. <laughs> oh, I like George. <laughs> that was really funny. 
<laughs> if I had been hunting for a tarantula, I would have been really ticked off by that, but I'm not. So that was really fun. We loved George instantly in like two seconds. I saw I saw his little bum waddle into the water and like, you know, it was love at first sight and then he was gone. And things happen. Things happen, you guys. <sighs> it's okay. We have, uh... We have Sam now. This is Sam, you guys. Apparently I'm just taking Stardew names today, don't mind me. <laughs> Sam witnessed the whole thing. Extreme reaction to certain scents. I can't go into certain stores. Oh gosh, that sucks. I always get really annoyed by walking past like stores like um like Lush and other places like that that have like all the bath bombs and stuff. But like, it just irritates me. It's not like too bad. Start seeing the Titanic theme. <laughs> I was like, dude, no, yeah, yeah. Okay, come on, game. You can spawn us this fish. That's all I want. Yeah, it's a real. I hate that store as well. Oh, <laughs> so Cherry, is it a funny URL? Late in game in the season when tarantulas and scorpions. I had my net out. Tarantula comes out of nowhere, scares the hell out of me, and I screamed. Dropped my 3DS. Oh no, was your, okay, was your 3DS okay? Um, but I'm glad you laughed at it at least. Tough. Uh, okay, well. <laughs> See my cousin on our lunch break. We're going to be smell their bath. Oh, and then leave. What kind of fish we're looking for? We're looking for the gar right now. It's in the lake. 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. June through to September. And we've had zero luck with it so far. <laughs> Sleepy cute Sam and Nom Nom. Oh my god, that's adorable. Yeah, even just walking by that that store is just like it like smacks you in the face, kinda. Bath and Body Works? Yeah. No. It, it's really bad in there as well. Okay, I thought I saw something there. Got it. I wonder if I went into the roost if that would help as well. Yeah, uh, I don't know if it's spelled with two R's or one R, but... Because you saw a spider in your game, yeah. <laughs> Bring the guard a cup of coffee in order to tempt it, yeah. That- that might actually work. <laughs> oh, were you about to sit on the bench? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Okay, those fish don't look big enough to be it. Just yeet the coffee into the river. <laughs> you can't go into the roost and not get coffee, but I can only get one coffee per day, right? So I could go in there, get coffee, drink it, go back in, and not get any coffee. Bruce is gonna be like, it's too late for coffee, go to bed. <laughs> you like this evening music as well? Yeah. This one's pretty chill. Coffee every 10 minutes? Yeah. Brewster. Coffee. I'd like a coffee, please. Uh, Teresa, plant lots and lots of trees and flowers. Um, and keep talking to Isabel. She'll keep telling you, like, you know, maybe you need more public works projects. Maybe you need more trees or flowers. That kind of stuff. Or maybe you have too much and you need to cut back on them. Hey, 
sleepy Pluto. How are you doing today? Welcome back. All right, got my. Co oh, right. Can't do that for inside for whatever reason. There we go. Sip. And fish. No. Come on, I can't splash in the water. <laughs> they start to get antsy and wide and they like start to move faster or something. I think people would abuse that, but it would be beautiful. Okay, I don't think that's it, but I'm gonna catch it anyway. Simply sipping fish. <laughs> oh, it's a turtle! Hi, buddy! He's like, please let me go. <laughs> this is not where I want to be. Aw, oh, keep it. We already. Don't we already have a turtle? We can't keep every turtle we get, you guys. Playing some Stardew? Oh my goodness, we were just talking about. We've, actually, we've been talking about Stardew pretty much the entire stream. Off and on. <gasps> Hi Dolphin Ranger, how's it going? That emote is so hacking cute. Alright, another sip for good luck. Come on, give me the fish I need, game. Teach it water gun. <laughs> game, come on, this isn't that hard. Spawn something in the in the lake. <laughs> I think I just heard an ominous ticking noise and I was trying to figure out where it was coming from. I think it's Mike's game, hopefully, that I just heard through his headphones. You're not the fish I wanted. But you are a fish, so I'll take you. Oh, Dolphin Ranger, have you? Well, welcome on- or- I guess- Hi. I was about to say welcome on in, I'm like, you, you just said you've been here for a while. <laughs> but either way, how are you doing? I've been playing starting for seven hours straight so far today. You guys are living your best lives and I appreciate that. I really do. If that's how you want to spend your day relaxing, then that's definitely how you should spend it. Oh my goodness, Sip. <laughs> I think he's the best bachelor in Stardew, none of them really appeal to me. I really like Sebastian. But Harvey is kind of my close second. I have never actually married Harvey, that being said. I've only married Sebastian before, so... Two days straight since you got back from your holiday. See, I think I would play for longer periods if the Switch didn't have, you know, a battery. On PC. On PC, I'd just be playing all day. It's kind of a good thing I haven't been. <laughs> no, okay. That's not what I need. Alright, I'm gonna try scaring away the other fish in the river and see if we can't get to spawn that way. It's like, maybe... Maybe, maybe, maybe... If we can get to spawn this way, it'd be fantastic. We need all the fish luck, as Katie's saying. <laughs> Adam! <laughs> Oh my goodness, Sip. <laughs> Please marry Penny so I don't feel guilty for choosing Leah over her. Penny is like, I have her my eye on her, don't worry. We're gonna start wooing all of them. Maybe one by one. Uh, just to see who we like most. So if you guys haven't joined into our Stardew streams, um, I'm kind of narrowing things down by saying I either want to marry Harvey, Leah, I think Abigail or Penny, those are my top four. And we're gonna choose between them eventually, but I want to see all their stories and stuff first. Oh my god, Sparkly. So, have you ever played any of the Harvest Moon games before? Because it's very similar. It is essentially like a, a farming 
RPG game. Um, but there's also other elements to it, so you hear us talking about bachelors and bachelorettes. Um, there's a whole relationship sim aspect to it. You can get married, you can have children, you can date people, uh, or you can just befriend people. Um, there's uh, mining, there's crafting, there's foraging. Um, there's a lot in the game, and it's very, very addicting, very fun. I did, but it's been so many years, don't remember too much. Oh, okay, so if if at all you've played Harvest Moon, you've essentially played something very similar enough to start you. Um, they pretty much go hand in hand. You're gonna woo Abigail? Penny was my second, but now I'm going for Abigail in my next form. Poor Penny. It seems like Penny always gets overlooked, and I did the same thing, so. Don't have a Switch yet. Christmas. Have to have, to have it for New Horizons. Oh, definitely. Um, Switch, or sorry, Stardew runs really good on everything I've played it on, which is, you know, PS4, Switch, and computer, so. But you can marry Krobus. I'm pretty sure there's a mod to do that if you really want to. If, if you're playing on PC, mind you. Oh, Panda Lover, enjoy your pizza. Actually, that's something Mike and I could do for tonight. We could have, like, an oven pizza or something. And maybe some salad. Doesn't sound bad to me. I chose Haley on my PC farm. My, she waters my crops even though I have sprinklers. <laughs> Alright, listen. We didn't say Haley was the smartest, but she's trying her best, I guess, right? <laughs> Only married the lovely Thea before, which is awesome, even if she is a salad fiend. <laughs> you quietly reminded me that I also like fellow gals. As well as lads, yeah. Yeah. I I wasn't expecting that from her, and I really like that. She also feeds my animals, even though it auto-feeds them. <laughs> I think being on the upper side of the river is probably better for what I'm doing right now. It's hard to see from this angle. Just upgrade my watering can. Why have I not done this sooner? Oh, Adam, do you do you just upgrade the one time, or what level did you upgrade it to? It makes me sad by low key. Just give them back to her because she's oh, because it's a loved gift. Yeah. Here, Brandon. Yes. Oh, Katie. Very nice. I haven't had the Iridium Water in Canada forever. We're not getting lucky with this fish. Getting your best to plant crops in specific spots, ease some of the workload. It would be nice. It would be nice. Like, I want them to add in the tractor thing as an official thing, not just a mod, personally, because that, that would take off uh, all that pressure. Um, Ma Manon? Am I saying your name right? Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Allow the kids to age a bit more? Yeah. That'd be pretty cool. Without Iridium Sprinklers, yeah, yeah. The fish literally knows. Oh no, 100%. It's just like, nah, I'm not gonna spawn. I value my life. <laughs> or I guess I should say my freedom, because if we're not killing it, we're donating it. More fish luck? I, I think we might need more fish luck. Then again, we've been very, very lucky this stream. We've got three different bugs that we needed. That I've been searching for for a couple weeks now, so I can't really complain, but... She's like, I saw what happened to George. <laughs> and the reason I don't want Mary Penny, she wants children? Uh, I don't. Oh. That might make me want Penny a little bit more. Plus, I've never married... 
a girl in the game yet playing as a girl, so that would be really interesting to see as well. Thank you for the fish and chat, you guys. Really <laughs> naming your ghastly George in his honor. <laughs> Thank you. George would have appreciated that. <laughs> Random. <laughs> Poor George, he was living his best life and he just kind of slipped in and fell. Ravenstar, exact same reason why I love that game so much. It is my top favorite. Um, I love the fact, it, of course, it puts like an end date essentially on the game because eventually, you know, your age will catch up to you, but... Wolf? Wolf Tear? Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Ark, welcome back. What'd you have for dinner? Tell me. <laughs> Which was so scary that he scared himself into the water. He was just- he was- oh! George? George! 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 No, 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 no. No, 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 You don't- you don't fall in. Don't you dare. Don't you- George? George? George! <laughs> uh, he did the despawn? No, shh, Ark, you didn't hear that. No! <laughs> George? George? Not George. <laughs> I feel like we're having deja vu right now, you guys. How are we seeing two tarantulas before we're seeing... This isn't even where you guys should go, but like, still. Before we're seeing this darn fish. keeping these. This is George. This is also George. And this is the turtle that you guys don't want me to get rid of. <laughs> Gosh darn it, George. Kills fish by dropping them into a different habitat? Listen, alright, they're not the fish that I need. We've seen two tarantulas tonight and we haven't seen the fish I'm looking for. Like, it's not even like I found it and I've scared it away. It's like legitimately we haven't seen it. How do I how do I manage such things, you guys? What is my luck? <laughs> George too. I mean Oh, ooh, didn't mean to catch that. Um did George really win, though? <laughs> Pepper, see Pepper's on my wavelength here. I also don't need this. You better not go on one of my village- oh. I didn't know that would fall. I thought it would, like, jump and go away. I totally just killed that mosquito. That's really awkward. None of you saw that. <laughs> Or mosquito? Flea! Not mosquito, sorry. I mean, technically we don't want fleas in memory, though, so I mean, like, you know. Can you blame me? Also, is it weird that I've kind of come to peace with the various tarantulas and scorpions in this game? I think mainly because I haven't been bit yet, but also the fact that, like, you know, I know what scares them and I know what causes them to attack me. Therefore, I'm not feeling so nervous about them anymore. Like, I could... Oh, you're happy. Like, I could walk right by and they're not going to go after me because I don't have the net out and I'm not actively going after them. Also, Berries, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. It fleed. <laughs> uh, okay. 
so far. Oh, Crave Emily, I hope she has a fantastic nap and welcome back. Not in City Folk, though. Even in City Folk, like, you know, we have gotten stung, but like. They they aren't chasing me, you know what I mean? Which makes me feel a lot more safe and comfortable around them. The second they start to chase me around, that gets a little bit nerve-wracking, but... Scuttle, scuttle! <laughs> but I want you guys to note, how many scorpions have we seen versus how many tarantulas have we seen? I see so many more tarantulas than scorpions, it's just... For whatever reason, I find the tarantulas ten times easier to find. Name it Crush Like Finding Nemo. I think that's what people are suggesting for the last turtle I caught. I'm pretty sure I do have a turtle in my house somewhere. I'll have to go check. That's meant to be gives me more fear than tarantula or scorpion? Yeah. In before Scorpio appears behind you. That would be very funny if it did. It'd be perfect timing too, but... Oops. Too many tarantulas, hashtag facts. <laughs> no, you're not what I want. We're just really not having the luck with this fish. This might be one that I have to catch off stream, you guys. Or, like, during a different stream, of course, mind you. Seeing my first cockroach, I really like spiders and tarantulas now. They come around almost as much as they do in Desert Island Escape? Yeah. No, I don't think we're getting lucky tonight, you guys. This kind of sucks. Oh no, Carolyn. Well, I mean, you know, I don't want scorpions to spawn and freak out anyone, but I hope you catch it soon if you're trying to catch it. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and check on uh, my house to see if I already have a turtle. Stream till fish. <laughs> At least we have until the end of September to catch this fish, though. That makes me a little bit more comfortable. But the fact is, we could have caught it back in June. <laughs> uh, turtle? Downstairs or upstairs? Uh, upstairs. Uh, Andrew, yeah, pretty much I think I'm gonna leave it this size at the moment. There he is. He was checking out Midge. Did I have the other one beside him? You guys seem very set on this turtle thing. No, you're facing the wrong way, buddy. There we go. Now they're both there together. I wish I could combine their tank, but... The gaming basement. Thank you! We could have one in every room, though, but then they wouldn't be together. So we need two in every room, and that gets a bit excessive. <laughs> Good morning, you can train them in the ninja arts. <laughs> you have a room of just frogs? That must be kind of noisy. Crazy turtle lady. Yeah, Ravenstar, this will actually be the very first time, hopefully, that I ever finish the museum, so this is pretty exciting. Oh, well. Oh, hi! You just suddenly started running after me. Okay. Come on, fish. We can do it. Alright, you know what I might do, you guys? Might take a little bit of fishing break. For now. Um, do you guys want to go listen? Actually. <gasps> is KK? KK's not still open, is he? <gasps> no, I want to go listen to more KK. 
<laughs> random. It's not open, is it? No, that looks very, very closed. I wanted to listen to more KK. Oh, shame. Not K. <laughs> this is not K. Time travel back? I don't know. We've done a lot of time traveling today. I feel bad for my, my game. You know what I'm gonna do instead? I'm gonna do the smart thing instead. Give me a second here. Uh, Ravenstar, you can, you can. Oh yeah, Harvey, you know what I'm about to do. Heck yeah, you use those maracas. I just heard Mike snap. <laughs> Wait. Wait, is he actually- Oh, he is doing it when I dance! He's only doing it when I dance! Harvey, yes! We need a Harvey in the Maracas emotes. I am so down for this. Heck yeah. Oh. Why do you stop? Is my shrunk shuffle not good enough for you? Oh wow, okay. Awkward. <laughs> okay, I'll go back over here. He stopped. Rude, I love it when he dances. I've never noticed him with the maracas before. Oh, that makes me so happy. <laughs> Do you just- do you stop at any emote I do? Oh, he doesn't seem that interested by my- yeah, he just stops. Okay, I see how it is, Harvey. Yeah, I'm gonna dance. Can I dance on this side? Yeah, I'll dance on this side. How about this side? Can I dance on this- I think I can dance on every side. <laughs> Him and Shrunk must have beef, maybe a little bit. Okay, Harvey. I'll leave you be, buddy. No, Pad, but we didn't. We we want to take a break and go listen to KK, but KK's not open anymore, so I went to Harvey instead. <laughs> I like that it's only by the fire, and it's only that fire, too. It's not the one that you can even place in your town, which is identical, by the way, I'm pretty sure. Um, it's only that fire. I'm gonna continue saving, continuing scaring away fish, because I feel like that's probably my best bet. Which Harvey could be a village in your town. I think it'd be interesting to see if you could have, or at least visit the homes of the shopkeeper NPCs and stuff like that. Argh, that emote is amazing. I love it so much. <laughs> What is that, Eva? Is that from that one that you and Andrew wa- Oh, yes it is. Love it. <laughs> I, uh, I had a sudden brainwave the other day for something fun to do for April Fools next year, but I re can't really tell you guys now, can I? I'm just gonna mention it in passing. I'm probably gonna forget what it is, honestly, but... Uh, that emote is kind of my only hint, I guess I should say. <laughs> I have- I have a funny idea, though. Taste- wait, what? Pepper, what? Pepper. Pepper, I promise I'm not tasting anyone, please. You make me scared now. <laughs> Only tasting I'm gonna do tonight is that sweet, sweet- or- Pizza shouldn't be sweet, but delicious pizza that I want to have for dinner. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, Pepper. Uh, Labellamart? I don't know if I'm saying it right. Welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follow. How are you doing? Write it down for yourself? I should. I should, like, have a, an alarm or something on my phone go off like a week before April Fool's next year and just be like, Crystal, do this. <laughs> I'm used to talking about food. 
Really random. I thought you would taste like just like pure salt. With all that saltiness at Mario Kart. Just saying. Shots fired. <laughs> but friendly shots. Friendly, friendly Canadian shots fired. Friendly shade. Okay, we're gonna do a save and continue. See if this spawns it. Shake T hashtag wig snatched. Oh, thank you so much. Yeah, this town is give or take, I think, what what is it, like eight, eight and a half months old, I think now. Um, and it's kind of my last town I'm gonna be doing before Animal Crossing New Horizons releases, so um thank you so very much. Wig snatch, but I'm bald, that's why it's wig snatch. <laughs> Soon Gab, hello, how you doing? Welcome back. It's splattered seahorse, hello. Uh, I'm kind of looking for a certain fish right now. We've gotten very lucky so far tonight, and we've caught three bugs that I need. Um, and I'm just looking for the gar right now, and it's only available in the lake, so I'm kind of going around and scaring away every other fish and hoping that it spawns. Um, if you guys are new here, you can always type in exclamation mark museum to check out, like, you know, what I still need to collect for the museum and other stuff as well, actually, now. Um... And you can see like what times things are available and stuff like that. No, Panda Lover, not yet. Not yet, it's like the last one I need right now. We'll make a whole new town right before the other one comes out. <laughs> it's been a worry of mine, honestly. Oh, Andrew, you definitely do. You definitely, definitely do. I need to see that for myself. <laughs> Don't travel back in the evening, so between like seven. Four and seven. See, I don't know when it's more likely to come out. That's the thing. Why worry? I'm just worried that like I'm gonna be like finished, and I use that term kind of loosely with this town before New Horizons releases, because um, I don't know what I'm gonna do otherwise. <laughs> As a send off, I lost my original three days in college. Oh no. Yeah, I really, like, I love New Leaf. It's been a favorite game of mine for a very long time. But I'm definitely ready for New Horizons, so I wanted to give it a proper, um, I like the word or phrase Toon Gab used, send off. They're on use of the day and they're snatching of tea and spilling of wigs. <laughs> uh, Pepper, he wanted to delete Rose Wolf. I wanted to delete Rose Wolf, which I didn't, but yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'll delete this, though. I told him I wouldn't do it because uh, I think people would freak out <laughs> at the end of, uh, of that playthrough. Yes, Ark, yes. Exactly like that. Except it's going to be mostly Shrunk Shuffles. <laughs> Yeah, it'd be a little bit traumatic, I feel like, yeah. Also, I wish I could catch all these fish and everything and sell them, but like... Um, I, uh, what's her name? Reese isn't open, so... Big or small? It's very big. It's only in that, like, center, um lake area as well. I'm just scaring away every single fish I see, just hoping to give it more room to spawn, but and saving and continuing as well, hoping that it'll spawn, but so far not that much luck. Oh, uh, her am crossing horizon switch light? Yeah, I know a lot of people want that. Same with my game too. Make a new town before New Horizons comes out and see how far I get. Yeah, there's a lot of people I know who have restarted in like the last year or so. Um, just kind of, you know, playing through, spending time until New Horizons.
I have a nasty feeling it's been spawning on the lower side here, though. I haven't been going down here. Try to restart, but I played this game way too much. Yeah, it comes to a point where, like, you know, you do get burnt out, and you'd never, ever really want to continue playing, you know? You shouldn't ever force your yourself to play a game. And before you find out, does it spawn right now? Do you have a flea again? I... I'm like 90% sure it spawns right now. <laughs> According to the wiki. <laughs> 4 p.m. to 9 a.m., yep. And we're currently at nearly one in the morning. And we're in August as well. That's the main thing as well, I guess. All night to get guard. <laughs> Already? The wonders of time traveling, Ark. The wonders of time traveling. <laughs> Yeah, you guys have convinced me. I think after stream and after dinner, I'm probably just gonna play some Stardew tonight. I'm feeling the Stardews. Mm, no, not what I want. I'll try and complete the museum, but just play to see what comes to my town. That's kind of what I start off as as well. I I knew I wanted to get perfect town, but I don't really ever find it too difficult to do that these days. Um, just because I know exactly what it wants. But um, I only start decided I think within the last month that I wanted to 100% complete the museum. Um, and it's been fun. It's been fun. Switch Stardew? Yes. No, I don't play on the on the PC one off stream. Actually, I don't. I don't have any ongoing farms on my PC right now. Mod starter where we can set fire to those things? Oh no. Hmm, Katie, I might jump in voice chat later on. It really kind of depends on how I'm feeling though. I know, Sammy, it was so disappointing. I really wanted that mod to work, but... It wasn't- it wasn't meant to be. Andrew, so far it is. So far it is. I haven't really made use of the monster spawns after... Like, at night yet. But, uh... Other than that, it's been really, really good. See anything there? A chicken gyro? Ooh! Oh my goodness, just like a- what is happening here? Um, that sounds really good. 10 out of 10 would eat. <laughs> You'd be too nervous to voice chat? There's people in here I know who, you know, I've actually known for years or I've spoken to online a lot who I've really haven't heard them talk too much because they are they are a little bit shy, but they generally come into the voice chats, keep themselves muted, and just listen to us talk. And it's super relaxing. And they just type back to us. Uh, Sophie, unfortunately not. Unfortunately not. Random is always muted, yep. But, uh, it's 100% understandable if anyone is ever shy. I'm shy, <laughs> constantly. Okay, you are not what I need. Always so nervous about trying voice chat, but as soon as I joined one and spoke, all that anxiety just went away for everyone so kind, yeah. Yeah, it it's very nice to see you guys getting along so well. Okay, 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 um, um, okay. Okay. Okay, I'm nervous that I'm gonna mispress the A button. Oh god, okay. We've been waiting for this for so long. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> nope. 
No, you're gonna act funny, aren't you? Okay. Do this. Fish, please notice me. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had to look away. Oh, you aren't it! Oh, are you joking? Are you even joking? What are you? Why are you here? Why are you always here? This is the fish I keep catching. This is not it. <laughs> I hate this fish so much. What is your face? Get out. Can we shun this fish now? You know, I don't even want- you know, I'm gonna sell you. No, I- she's not even open right now, but I'm still gonna sell you. <sighs> that was so incredibly disappointing. That was, like, oh, my heart hurts. <laughs> Oh, that made me so sad. I thought we had it. For the second time tonight, I thought we had it. And we didn't. Gosh, thank you, Princess Shrew. Yeah, no, I'm also... <laughs> Andrew, I'm sorry. I know I know it's your guinea pig. I'm sorry. <laughs> Sell it to a sushi restaurant. Gosh, what an annoying fish. What an absolutely annoying fish. And I don't mean anything against your guinea pig, Andrew. I'm sure your guinea pig was lovely. But like... Run on a wall and make it sing a stupid song. <laughs> Why must you always spawn there? Why was like, Are you even a, a lake fish? Oh. God, <laughs> I'm really angry right now. I am really, really angry. Is that a fish? What is that? You're an eel. <laughs> I don't need you. Go away. Oh. Man, Andrew, my heart is still beating really fast. <laughs> I am angry and I'm laughing. You're right. Oh. What on earth? What on earth? <sighs> Even continue. <laughs> Light and gray. <laughs> Time to rage giggle. One more try, you guys. One more try. What an annoying fish. I'm gonna enjoy the bells I earn off that fish. There's not even anything here. It's a stupid eel again. <laughs> oh, that fish is the biggest troll to ever troll. Maybe that was George coming back being like, "How? how why didn't you save me? Release it into the seawater, that'll show it. I'd rather earn the bells from it, honestly. I'd rather earn the bells. I forgot that Nat was here, even. You guys know what me standing in front of this tree means. <laughs> it means this is the end of stream. We've been streaming for quite a while today. Oh, that timing, though. I want to thank you guys very much for watching and hanging out with me today. We're gonna get that fish. Like, 100%, we are gonna get that fish, and we are going to enjoy it. <laughs> and that fish is going straight into Blather's hands. But that will not be tonight. I want to thank you guys so very much for hanging out with me today, and chatting, and making me want to play Stardew more than I already did. Uh, we're gonna go over and host Megan Crossing. I want to give you guys a forewarning if you guys watch for my family-friendly or PG content. She is not so PG, and that's 100% cool. She's awesome. But just in case you care about swearing or stuff like that. Um, oh no, Pineapple Allen, I'm sorry, you just came in here. <laughs> Thank you guys so very much for watching and hanging out. I'll be back tomorrow with our usual slumber party Sunday. Um, and maybe some fireworks after that. But, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.